morning, everyone. How are we doing today? I hope we're well. Um, <laughs> happy. Is it Sunday? I think it might be Sunday, right? <laughs> Kind of lost track of the day. For some reason, I thought, um, so if it's Sunday for you guys, today's Monday here. For some reason, I thought yesterday was Monday, and I was waiting for uh, a package to arrive that never would arrive because it was Sunday and there's no post on Sundays. <laughs> yes, so uh, we are hosting today uh, a special giveaway courtesy of uh, community member Rubik's Cubed who uh, got another edition of Baldur's Gate. They got like the special edition and they got an extra code in there because uh, they already had the game. They uh, gifted it to uh, the community. Um, and that one is uh, exclusive to YouTube. So make sure you head over to YouTube and type in hashtag Nat20 there uh, if you want to enter. And uh, the, we're going to draw that at the end of the stream. <laughs> You've got a chance to get your hands in a copy if you've been watching us play, uh, but maybe haven't picked it up yet, but you've been thinking about it. <laughs> Promise you won't regret it. <laughs> How are we all doing today? My chat bot said it was having trouble connecting today, but it seems to be picking up everybody just fine. So that's kind of good. Hmm. Not sure. Let's see who we've got um, in chat today. Uh, we got Jason, Kara, Whisper, Attack, uh, Victor, Kara, uh, LaShawn, Whisper, Extreme. We've got uh, Pure Blood. We got Penguin, NY, Laudable, Lena, uh, Bulbasaur. Over on the Twitch as well today. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi, Dragon. Oh, the lovely Tack. Well, any friend of Tack is a friend of mine. You got a hot cup of... Oh, that sounds nice. I like, in winter, hot chocolate with like a little dash of mint in there. It's really, really nice. I haven't tried it with... Uh, I haven't tried mint tea yet, though, but I feel like I probably like it. <laughs> sounds good, though. Mmm. Um, it should be fine. Nightbot should handle it today. I've, I've figured it out. <laughs> and um, so what it does is it puts everybody's names who's in chat in a window, but they have a special icon if they, if they enter the keyword. And it seems to be doing it correctly today. I can see all the names, but only the people who typed in Nat20 right now have the icon. So I think, I think it's working. <laughs> So far, so good. <laughs> Mint tea is one of your favorites. You you, uh, you highly recommend. <laughs> oh, so today we're going to Grimforge, and this was unintentional, but our house is like an oven today because it just suddenly got really warm overnight. Um, so if anybody asks, and um, Starin's a sweaty mess today, just just tell them we're. It's really, we just really go hard for the cosplay, you know? <laughs> if anyone asks. <laughs> yes, yesterday was, in fact, uh, International Asexuality Day. Yes, that's true. Yeah, apparently 6th of April. 6th of April. Yeah. Our day. <laughs> he does look good when he's sweaty. Yeah. So we love Grimforge for that, don't we? <laughs> I remember the first time I was there, I was just so in awe that they had um, made a texture for that, you know, that that when you were in Grimforge, everyone was like a sweaty mess. I hadn't really seen a game do that before. I'd seen, you know, like, like characters, like you go in water, they get wet, but I hadn't seen like volcano sweat before, you know? <laughs> House and sweating gives you life. Oh, do you like wait so you can bring house in there? Mmm. <laughs> Mint tea was the first tea you ever drank. Oh, I imagine it's probably nicer than regular tea. Regular tea is a bit too bitter for me, which I know is probably a crime for me to say as a Brita British person, but yeah. Not quite hit that age yet where I'm like, yay, tea. 
I admit nothing, Kay. That's a yes, then. <laughs> oh, goodness. No. Um, I haven't actually seen Halston down there. Mm. I always get him after. We've got Gail, Lazel, and Karlak with us. So far. Today we've probably got two boss fights. Probably uh, near and uh, the Forge. The Forge is really the only one I'm worried about, but it should be fine. We're going to have a Starion up top, so... Worst comes to worst, you know. Everyone else downstairs gets nuked. You can run off. Res everyone at Wivers. And then we can try it again. Hello. Denny's like, where's my tea? <laughs> hey, Allie. It'd be less bitter if you mic- No, no, don't, no, no, microwaving your tea. <laughs> Blast thank you tag. <laughs> Blasphemy, honestly. I heard if you microwave your tea, um, the uh, the queen f will go to your house herself and arrest you. <laughs> Kitty bum. It is wild. I didn't know people did that until it became a chat debate one day. Someone said they microwaved their tea and I thought they were joking. I was like... They don't have kettles in America. <laughs> Apparently they do. It's just people don't you prefer to microwave it. So that was that was wild for me, yeah. You like your tea bitter and you ah, you leave the tea bag in so you can get that taste. Oh, Jenny. Uh uh. No no. She's trying to steal the shadow heart things. I've got them in the corner. Thank you, Dragon. I'm glad you like the cosplay. Yeah, today we're in the vanilla outfit. <laughs> Yesterday was camp, camp, camp Astarian. I quite like this outfit. It's very like, this outfit's very theatrical, so I feel like it suits him. Hmm. We're gonna do some ASMR can opening. Because Kay didn't sleep, but I think that's probably fine. I have a surprising amount of energy. I ended up having a nap yesterday, so I think that saved the day. Extra risky on a mode, no sleep. <laughs> fizzy bubbles. We love the fizzy bubbles. Microwaving it messes with. You see, I feel like it would. I feel like it would mess with the flavor. I feel like if you. Let me just change the microphone back. I feel like if you gave me two cups of tea and one of them had been microwaved and one of them, you know, you done with kettle, I reckon I could tell. <laughs> Who needs sleep? Not me. Not me, darling. Vampires don't sleep. Um, you got an amazing catnip bird that makes a quiet chirping noise and your cat loves it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, toys that make little squeaky noises. Cats love. Nuka really likes the noisy toys. Um, he likes the noisy toys at obscene hours in the morning. I'm talking like 2 a.m. That's when Nuka likes to play with squeaky toys. What? What's the Samava? What is that? Is it a type of kettle? He inspired me to try Carlac cosplay. Your cosplay was amazing, Tat. You did such a good job. I loved it. The bar is the bar is high for Carlac. <laughs> no. I haven't done Lazel, no. No, Lazel. Lazel maybe would be one level difficulty higher than Carlac. Oh, but then you know she has the horns to stick on. Lazel would need a prosthetic on the nose. Oh, it's like a tea brewer. Ah. I see. Mm, there's lots of different ways of making teas around the world. <laughs> you use a, a curing to make tea. Hey, Ruxy. Ah, the Kalani on Twitch. 
See, now how I said I was going to fix my sleep schedule. Well, I stayed up till 4 a.m. playing Baldur's Gate. That sounds about right. <laughs> That's our life now, Whisper. That, yeah. People ask, hey, why didn't you get any sleep? Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so wait, there is a couple of like um, prosthetics for the, like the Who's and the Grinch that would kind of work for Lazel. There's quite a few people who make those on Etsy. Um, it'd just be a bit more, you know, if you were doing it for a series of streams, it would be a lot of maintenance because you might have to get more than one prosthetic because it'll be a bit flimsy, probably. Um, oh, what's that? The name's escaping me for the material. But yeah, it'd be, it'd be easy to break. Mm. Oh, it's really fancy. Not latex, the other one. The, the one that's more flimsy. I don't think the name's completely escaped. This is <laughs> not a good sign for the honor run today. Uh, not latex, the other one. Latex is, is these. These are latex. A lot of people are allergic to it. <laughs> what is it? What's the material called? Silicone! Thank you. Thank you, ba Bean. Silicone. Yeah. Yeah. Quite a few people are allergic to silicone, so... Sometimes I'll get latex instead. Or vice versa. But yeah, yeah, so it would be like a, a yeah, probably made of silicone, I think. Currently in hospital. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you're doing okay. Are you gonna are you got any any ETA on when you'll be able to go home? Oh goodness. Worried about you. Um the brain rot is real, right? <laughs> What is real life? I only know Baldur's Gate. Hey, guard. I hope you're well. With with Carlac, it's it's the paint and the horns that I think will be that are tricky. But yeah, with Lazel, instead of horns, you've got you probably need a prosthetic on her nose. Mm. But there's plenty, like I said, you know, if you're thinking about doing a Lazel cosplay, there's a lot of people who make prosthetics on Etsy that have um, some some great sort of noses that I think would work well for Lazel. Also, Gif Yankee ears as well. They got some of those too last time I looked. If you're not sure how to make your own. Hey, Stripes, how you doing? I hope you're well. Welcome. You're not sure when you go home, but oh, I'm glad you're getting better, though. Oh, goodness, we'll be thinking of you. Hoping you recover quickly, yeah? Ooh. 2024, eh? It's, not, it's, it's been a pretty rough year so far for everyone, it feels like. Goodness. That year's like a Welsh corgi. Every time you see it, you want to bite it off. Wait, what? My... <laughs> It's, there are, uh, there are high elf ears. Mm -hmm. A red body suit, so, yeah. So for anything involving paint, I recommend a bodysuit. Yeah. Wherever you're doing like Auron, um, Carlac, Lazel. You can do a bodysuit with some color magic. That's going to make your life easier, because then you don't have to paint your entire body. Maybe just like your neck and your head. There are a lot of ways you can hide the seams for bodysuits, too. Um, like, I don't know, if, if the seams on the neck, you could have like a necklace or a choker or something to um, conceal it. Clothing parts. So, yeah, yeah. If we do end up doing that Carlac run, I'd probably go bodysuit with paint. Mm. Um, depends on the paint you use, really. A lot of it, like the one I use, 
You remember when we did the clown? The clown makeup at the carnival. Uh, so the one I use pretty much just will wash straight off. Because uh, it reacts to water. Um, even if you put powder on it, unless there's like... It'll stay on, unless someone throws a bucket at you of water. <laughs> But it shouldn't stain too much. There was a lot of red on that. But it still came right off. A bodysuit would have saved me a lot of trouble. My second cosplay was Dark Link from L.O.Z. And I used body paint on my face, neck, and arms. And I took a shower after the con. It left dark marks on the side of the bathtub. Oh, no. <laughs> Just the bathroom was a completely different color after. Goodness. Hi, Drac. I hope you're well. Welcome. Hmm. Um, I've forgotten what the brands are that I've used. Hang on. I've got two. Alright, this one is Paradise Makeup, Meron. This one came pretty recommended. This is the black one, so it's almost it's a mess. And then we use, I use this for the Cyberpunk cosplay. It's some metallic, but Snazaru. Also, another brand that came highly recommended to me. I believe they're both vegan. If um, that's something you want to look out for. As far as I'm aware. I think this one's made in England. It's Nazaru. Both um, react to water. So easy to wash off. If you want to um if you're going to be, like, going to a convention, maybe it's summer, you'll probably want to put some powder on over it so it doesn't rub off too much. It'll probably rub off a little bit onto your clothes, but not too much if you if you put some powder over it. That dark grey body paint was a pain to scrub off. Don't buy it. It was Party City. That one's a bit hard to uh, rub off, says Bulbasaur. Hey, Stripes. <laughs> But those two brands have been pretty good for me. We've used them for the Baldur's Gate cosplays and the Cyberpunk cosplays so far. Snazaru have nice metallic ones if you're ever doing something cyberpunky. You got a lot of really good metallic colors. I used their paint for uh we had like some cyberware here on our character. So I used the silver, and then she had blue, this, like, metallic blue eyeliner that we put on. <laughs> then she had blue hair. <laughs> yeah, I think um, body paint can be very daunting at first. Um... Because I think the first thing everyone's going to worry about is, you know, it's staining. Can they wash it off? Is it going to rub off on things? Um, but it's, yeah, it's not too bad. Once you start, you can get into it. It's not, it's not too bad. Just a little scary at first. <laughs> yep, yep. Uh, so make sure um, you pop over to YouTube and type in hashtag Nat20 if you want a chance to win the Baldur's Gate copy today. Um, I don't know how to do a giveaway where it takes the entries from both platforms. So it's a YouTube exclusive on that today. Because we only have one. One copy. That's for Steam PC, the standard edition. Good you seem to be. <laughs> Thanks, Drac. Well, you know, we got to keep on trucking. Regardless of what happens, we got to keep on trucking, right? <laughs> Things are, you know, it's it's rough lately, but we keep on trucking. Hopefully you're having a good weekend, though. I'm trying to think of whatever fights in Act 1 I'm a little nervous about. I'm not too worried about the hag, honestly. I think the I think Ethel's going to be fine. The only worry there is if we can get the hair or not. <clears throat> if we get lucky. On my test run, he got it immediately, so 
I feel like we might have to re-roll. So I need some inspiration. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rubik's got theirs already. That's why we have an extra code, because uh, one of our community members, Rubik's uh, Cube, got their edition. Uh, but they already had the game. Um, so they gave the code to the community. So they're definitely landing. Might depend on where you are in the world, if it, if it takes longer or not, though. Mm. But I've, I've seen a lot of people on Twitter post uh, that they got theirs as well. So they've definitely started shipping them out. Which is good. So, you should get it soon, I think. It looks really good. I wish they shipped them here. Uh, but they don't really... They don't really ship to Asia, sadly. Not even Japan. Which surprised me, because they released the game in Japan. But, um... You know, the shop doesn't ship there, sadly. Kind of the same with the Bethesda store, too. They don't really ship over here. Assuming there's some reason for it. Right, shall we, uh, shall we dive into game? I respect Karlak a little bit. I don't know, I might, I might do it again. I've been doing a lot more class respecking this run, this run. <laughs> so, Wivers, we're probably going to steal a bunch of gold from Wivers soon. Right? It's, um, it's rough being here sometimes, isn't it, Kim? <laughs> Why don't we get the good stuff, too? Because I would have, the, the, the deluxe edition, the vinyl, I want the vinyl. I don't have a vinyl player, but I want the vinyl because the artwork on it is just so beautiful. Just to have it on display, you know? It's, the, the artwork on it is incredible. Oh, okay. Astarian's Omelium. Uh, because we didn't hand that in and we need to hand that in. But what I did was I kind of made a potion with the... Tongue, tongue of madness, and I, I don't know if it's okay. I think it's okay. I think we might have made the potion that he makes us. Um, so we're gonna see if we're gonna see what happens and if I completely mess that up or not, because we do actually need some items he has. Withers resurrects your buddies and helps you change your class. Yet you steal from him. Have In my defense, he doesn't care. <laughs> yes. Also, what's he going to do with all that gold anyway? I mean... <laughs> he's practically a zombie. <laughs> it's not like he's going to go get his hair done. <laughs> trying to think of, like, uh, what Starion's excuse would be there. You, child of the dark. How has your so, uh, yeah, we don't have the Tongue of Madness, fairly. but I, I did make a potion. Hmm, <laughs> here, I, I made a potion of those mushrooms. Uh, will this work? Yes. He buys milk. <laughs> Although it may be a touch cold. <laughs> what, what, do he, what does he need milk for? Maybe he's just saving up all the... It'd be so funny if he saved up all the gold for the epilogue party. And if you ended up stealing from him throughout the game, the party was just really lackluster. Like, there was less food and less wine. And maybe uh, the bard god didn't even show up. <laughs> for strong bones. He likes to keep, he likes to, um, you know, keep him strong. <laughs> He's not got much left, so. All right, well, what exactly is it going to do? It will lower the psionic defenses around the lava. If, if it was the origin run, he'd be like, here, Gale, you drink I it. I still be able to tell you more about its origin. All right. The potion is disgusting beyond description. The only mercy is that it goes down quickly. <laughs> Not a Don't think he enjoyed left. that. Very good. As the potion influences your mind, you may find yourself acting acting irrationally. I feel like we do that a lot anyway. <laughs> and stay focused. Like, you know, when Starion went out of the, the bubble dome edges, uh, at the Raphael fight and got himself killed. Like that day. Fluid, but trapped like a creature suspended in amber. Mmm. Uh, it's free or free. Oh, this one doesn't have a minus, though. Oh, dear. Um, it's probably fine. Sinking. I think it's just a temporarily temporary debuff, so no end. 
We don't. I don't think we have to worry too much about um. Tight. The temple spasms, seizes. It's fighting the ocean even harder than you are. Fear pierces your mind like knives of ice. The parasite digs deeper, as if it needs to hollow out your yeah. skull. Okay. <laughs> Resist the panic. Drown it out. Um. Let's try that. Oh, okay, nat 20. That's better. <laughs> the, cold the first roll. Edge. You know, he was, uh, turning that tide was just, uh, just warming up. Itself. The parasite swells with power. Maybe fine. More power than oh. you have ever felt before. This is the power hungry it's star in run, so he probably likes that. Lashing out against that which would dare to intrude. <gasps> the parasite in your mind quiets, pleased with itself. Oh, Melo, are you well? Welcome! Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good day today. Never observed before. Its power is unsettling. You know, it's probably bad if Omelium is also quite worried about it. <laughs> mm. I felt it grow inside me. There's more power than ever. Such an outcome was not in my calculations. There is more to this I've never actually used the ring that he gives you. You know, the one that's supposed to sort of um, quell the power of the parasite. I've never really used it because she most playthroughs I'll at least get Look of the Realms. So I end up using them. Hmm. I suppose it's not all bad. More power is better than less. Yet that power it doesn't really do much, you feel. Mm. You feel like it's more of a narrative device, maybe, than a solution. sort of functional if item. You are in need. I possess a ring of mind shielding. It prevents hey, Cor. Hi, Aya. Hope you well. Presence. Welcome. It will not remove the lava. But it will limit its influence, both positive and negative. I would offer it as a gift. Yeah, it felt that way. Mm. Truth, you didn't press the, the issue though, so you're not sure if you missed priceless. something. Oh, it's just an Is advantage on saving throws against being turn. charmed. Ah, okay, yeah, more of a narrative device then. Right. <laughs> Give me the ring or I'll run you through. Um, no. I just wanted his shop. Got a salt some thing. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. We need these. Um, we also need. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah, saving throws against being charmed. Reverberation. Oh, first, yeah, I need that first. Mm-hmm. Regale. Those potions as well. Uh, Gale's not really going to be obscured much. I'll probably pick it up later just in case we decide to use it. So you usually pick it up just in case. <clears throat> but for now, we'll just get that. I do like using fruit. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's got a, just a minor headache. <laughs> Hi, Smiley. How are you? I hope you're well. Welcome. Hey, Cap. Such an accelerated rate. <laughs> oh dear. That's, it might be more of a migraine. Impossible. It'll be fine in two turns. Okay, that's for Gale. That rings for Gale too. Goodies for Gale. The um. Psychic potions for when we get to near, but also it's good to stock up on those because we're gonna we're gonna need them soon. All right, let's send him back to the Grim Forge now. Now that he's um, done that, mostly put him there so I wouldn't forget. I'm doing all right. Yeah, not too bad. I hope your weekend's been good. No rest for the wicked, I see. 
Given these reverberation boots. And that ring. Boom. I also gave him this. It's mostly so we get a free blast. He's not really hitting things with his weapon, so I gave him this so we get the blast um, and the attack roll bonus. Because we can't use this right now on him. I have been considering changing the cleric. I don't know. Uh, I do want. I would prefer to have someone with that weapon. Keep your distance, darling. I think we can give him a proficiency through a feat as well. There's also that possibility. Oh, he did lots of resting. Oh, that's good. It's good to have a resting day sometimes, right? Um, it very. It's very early in the day for me. It's only six. <laughs> I feel like uh, you're working. Oh, you get you getting stuff done today, are you? Watch the shadows. I think this is the first time I haven't had Shadowheart with me here. Usually, I bring her every time. Dog Justicia Journal. These are all the Justicias that got killed by the orphan. If you look at the skeletons. You realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. No burial. Just slaughter. Damn. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. No use in trying to figure out what happened hundreds of years ago. Let's just focus on our Down problems at hand. Less about them, more about me. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's like, that's a problem for a futurist star to worry about. As long as there's nothing nasty going to boopers right now, we are fine. Oh, you're, you're just trying to play catch up. Is it a bit of a spring, spring cleaning? A crooked touch. Ding. No Dwergar made this. The design looks sharp. We'll uh, send just a star in to go get the thing down here. Just a chest. I think we'll do near before we do the forge. That'll probably be easier. And we're going to try and get those Dwegar on our side because th that's going to be the easier fight because then we don't have to fight absolutely everybody. And if we want to boop them, we can boop them after. Traps. I've only got two inspiration left, though, so we need to kind of build that up. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Run away! <laughs> oh, he's fine. I was worried that was going to um, send him flying. Is that the... Oh, it's the lightning aura. I have considered, like, an early lightning setup with Gale. That's another thing you can kind of do with your, uh, cleric. But if you have all the lightning items, can be quite effective. It's just, you, you really want to utilize them, you know? If you're going to do something like that. Hi! How you doing, Em? Welcome. I hope you're good. Yes, the star ends are on a run star. He's doing all right so far. <laughs> it probably would take me a whole year just to finish a run. It, finishing Baldur's Gate is one of the hardest things you'll ever do. <laughs> because you just don't want it to end. The, the, um, the length of time I linger in the epilogue because I don't want it to be over. It's like, no, Wivers, it's technically not over until I talk to you. So I'm just not going to talk to you. <laughs> and then it can't end. Let's keep your hands down. Okay. <laughs> Let me get the animal potions. You. Oh, oh, okay. That rubble needs clearing. And my patience is hanging on by an ass whisker. We'll try and convince the uh convince them to turn against the masters. 
Hmm. It almost sounds like you're asking for help if I ignore your tone. And it sounds like your ass wants for a lashing. The way you talk out of it. Something spoots the dumb shits. So stop your join and get to working. Hmm. All right, leave it to me. Go on then. Light a fire under the buggers. <laughs> we'll light a fire, all right. It's not the fire you were expecting. All right. Hopefully, this will be fine. No more. <laughs> I don't like it when I have no to fight them because you're kind of cute. All must die. Mm, okay, so what we want to do is... Yes, give in to your rage and avenge your pain. Don't strike us all, just your masters. You got this mod where Withers looks like the original concept. Oh, you know, I don't think yes. I've seen his original concept they art. The pain. Do you have a picture of it? They feel it? Now I'm so curious. Did he have more? Was he more fleshy before? Put him down and then or more skeleton-y? I'm so curious. <laughs> Let's try and take his weapon. Ding. Oh, sweet. I find on Tactician and above, you want to, when they drop their weapon, you want to take it because they will pick it back up. And if you take it, uh, they can't take it back. <laughs> but also, if you don't, they'll still miss a turn because it takes them an action to put it back. Well, that was a good start, Lazel. Oh, everyone got to go first except Gale. Down the hatch. <laughs> oh. Uh, Karlak's been missing a lot. I need to figure out what's going on there. I don't think she's... She's not using anything she's not proficient with. So I'm not entirely sure why her hit chance is so bad, honestly. It'll be 65% and she'll miss what it feels like half of the time. <laughs> it's funny because in the last playthrough, we were doing the um, the story origin run for Astarian. She hit on, what was it, like a 5% hit chance or something? It was something super low. Like, really crazy. And uh, so I'm really surprised that it's it's so bad this time. Because <laughs> she did so well before. The trickiest part? Ooh. I'm not too worried about the bosses because I feel like I have good strategies for them. It's stuff in between that I'm more worried about. Like we get caught in a trap that I forgot about or wasn't expecting. They get set off. And I accidentally had the whole group there, and they're in a nice little bundle to, you know, get nuked at the same time. Or something silly, like we fall, or a bug. A little bit worried about that. Uh, act two. Bosses, if we can talk our way through, it's fine. But if we get really unlucky and have to fight them... The gold boss does a, has a nasty one-shot. Um, but there's things we can do to kind of avoid getting completely wrecked in that fight, like bringing our gold back to camp because the damage she deals is based on the amount of gold that you're carrying. So if we put our gold back in camp... I also steal the gold in the area just as a fail-safe too, like out of the safe, out of, off the floor, just in case she can utilize that too. Um, but yeah, she could be a bit tricky if we have to fight her. Um, and the brew, the brewery, the big brewery monster, if you can't sort of drink him to explosion, he can be a little rough. So we really want to win that drinking competition if we can. So my plan for act two is we use the dexterity gloves and we bump up his charisma. Bring the dexterity down because the gloves are going to bring it up to 80, 18 anyway. And then we're going to just pile on charisma so he can pass those checks. Now, the good thing is he's a rogue, so he's going to have some extra proficiency against the gold boss. 
Uh, he's also got performance proficiency, just by default. So that's going to help against the drinking boss. That's kind of the plan. With haste. So act two might be fine, could be tricky. Really depends on the dice rolls and inspiration that we saved. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like a reverse. Yeah, basically. So the more gold, the the the, the nasty of the attack. Yeah, she basically uses it against you. Something sparkling in there. There's an achievement for that as well, where you can um. It, it basically, if you talk her into destroying herself, then you get the achievement um, of killing her without her using gold against you. Hello, I can't think that's the easiest more. way to get it. We'll wait, wait until it's safe to leave. All right, do me a favor. Smash that rubble before you go. You helped me. I helped you. want to know what's behind there. Why? Ooh. They, I think they only hit a star in there, didn't they? They didn't really, they didn't really care about anyone else. Oh, I think one of them got <laughs> got knocked off the ledge because we're we're missing one. The barbarian, I think, got yeeted. A boss fight where the solution is basically to be poor. Yeah, yeah. So. For those fights, what I'm going to do is position everybody in the off chance that Astarian fails the dialogue checks, just so they're not all bundled together and we're in a, a, a good position should we have to fight. And there's someone kind of near the exit if we need to retreat. Uh, with the gold boss, there's actually a floorboard that you can... Uh, there's a statue and you can shoot it to fall on the floorboard and then the floorboard collapses. You can actually bring her there so she'll fall through and she's she's pretty useless after that <laughs> and easy to take down. So I had everyone on my test run positioned just behind it. So if she did, if Starring failed the check and then she nuked him, they'd go for them and, you know, they could collapse that floorboard and uh, bring him back. Yeah, I require gold! <laughs> that one. Finally a boss fight where being a college student comes in handy. <laughs> like, I don't have any gold, mate. I'm a college student. <laughs> you think I have gold? <laughs> ah! There are traps about. All right. Oh, spider. I don't even know. The spider's probably still in the marsh somewhere. Oh dear. Someone's left a trap out for us. Gotta get that statue for Shadow Heart so she doesn't, uh, we don't lose her in Act 2. I have a really, really bad track record with Shadow Heart and, um, like that part for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. <laughs> But, um, she has died twice. <laughs> because she turned against the group. Did I, do, do I even have a misty step? Oh, I do. I'm usually just misty step into here. Easy peasy. Sir. Do, do, do. Send that to camp. Gail's a cleric right now. We're doing our Shadow Heart origin run after this, so that's why we've got Gale as a cleric. Oh, no worries, Whisper. Let me know when it's up and I'll have a look-see. Because I've seen quite a few of the characters' early concept designs, like Cazador, but I've not actually... I don't think I've seen Whoopers. Oh, I think it's... Oh, it's disabled. It doesn't matter now. I can walk over them. Oh, yeah, just gonna go grab the stuff from down here. I even saved against the attack and that was half damage. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, there's a couple of things you can do to protect against her. It's just if, if you kind of end up fighting her there unaware, it can be really nasty. <laughs> I 
Um, on my test run, the only one I wasn't able to talk my way out of was the Orphan because, um, and it was kind of my fault, I accidentally triggered the fight because I snuck up on him instead of just running up to talk to him. Um, but Starion took them all out on his own, including the Orphan, so I think the setup I had for that fight was pretty solid. Everyone else was just waiting by the steps. He also took out Balthazar and Balthazar's um, enemies on his own too. Leading me to believe the build may have been just slightly overpowered. Basically going in, sneaking, taking an enemy out. You know, running back a bit so they couldn't see me. Going back in, taking another one out. Just kind of picking them off one by one. Ended up being really effective in Act 2. What Temu? What is Temu? Uh, you saw the ad for hard plastic shoe tubs from mobile foot soaks. What? <laughs> That's a sentence. <laughs> Polymorph is also really uh, effective as well. Oh, Polymorph. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like turning, yeah. Can you turn her into a sheep? I never, I never tried Polymorph on her. I tried to turn Cazador into a sheet last playthrough, but he kept resisting against it. So we just made him dance instead. We only had the one scroll. And it turns out he did he was against fun. So we just made him dance. Gonna bring the spider back. It's I don't know where it is, but it's not here. <laughs> it was uh, probably still in the marshland somewhere. Oh, nice. Five turns later, she turns back. Oh, d uh, right, nice. Ah. Yeah, that's, that sounds like a... Yeah, if you can... What's the percentage chance on turning her into a sheep? It's not like Dwerger to be so bold. Pretty poor. We need to get that near guy unstuck. Well, those gnomes are done Ooh, for. yes. I failed the perception check to use a contract against him, and that's what. <gasps> no! Ah, the Orphan booped you. A theft has been reported, and um, it seems you're the only suspect. Oops. <laughs> Choose your next step wisely. Uh, excuse me. Someone of my rank wouldn't disturb. Be won't be disturbed by someone like you. I just just have him use his authority. <laughs> Fake authority. You had about oh sixty with Gale. Oh, it's not too bad. Sixty with Gale. Ah, uh, you were using Partant Wizard, so you could ask. Uh, so you could get it either way. Gotcha, gotcha. Right, we're gonna take out this guy. Let's go to the shadows. Speak. Mostly because I just don't like him. <laughs> All right, let's take him out. You attacked someone. Oh no! Oh! I was on Lazel. <laughs> Where's Shovel? Saving gnomes? It's so funny because in the epilogue, I think it's if you go to the. You choose the option where you go to the Underdark with him. He does start complaining about the other vampires killing the gnomes and um, how he's kind of sick of it. So he he certainly changes his tune, Spawn a Star in at the end, which is nice. Lizelle is wearing. Um, it's from the Cambian and Githyanki set from Nexus. So it's a, it's a sort of gif Yankee good. styled armor. It's really nice. Um, just get starring over here. Gail's just sitting in a pool of acid. Oh, I pressed space bar, didn't I? Ah! 
Yay. Oh, yeah, hang on. I gotta... Yeah, you can check out my mod list here. There's a lot of clothes. I use the clothes and then the transmog mod. I don't really like uh, using modded overpowered items, so... I use, um, I get those and then I just use a transmog mod with them. It, it's rare to come across a clothing mod that doesn't work with transmog. Most of them will. Which is nice. Stop missing! <laughs> Tail for the ages. Right? It's such... I feel like it's such a... Once you start using it, it's such a necessity. It's such a good mod. Because you can kind of just dress everybody up how you want. I feel like it adds to the whole role-playing element of your playthrough as well. Um, that's like the hardest part whenever there's an update. And you've got to, you know, you got to wait a couple of days for SE to update. That That's the hardest part. Because you, you can't play with Transmog. <laughs> because it requires it. I would follow. There's so many nice modded outfits out there now. Like, Astarin's wearing this ranger outfit that I think really suits him. We got Gale in this really lovely wizard outfit. Let me just take that. There you go. It's got a little book. And look, there's this little pouch on the back there. That um, you use if he dies. And he's got a little healing potion. Got him in his sort of Professor Gale colours. Carlax wearing the, one of the Cambion outfits. That was originally why I got that set for Carlax, because I just it just really suits her. She looks great in it. And Lazel's wearing one of the uh the Gifyanki uh, armors. Yeah. Was it hard to get Everburn? No! No, we got it. Well, we had to do Command Halt twice, but she got it on the second turn. We also killed the Cambion too, though. Um, we killed the Cambion and the Mind Flare. <laughs> so we dropped in a nice, solid level two. Yeah, oh, Norba is, uh, they are a, a trooper. Um, they get it up, so, uh, they do the updates so fast. Yeah. The only times when we've really had to wait a couple of days is when the files got recompiled on on Larian's side. Okay. Hopefully, I can pass the check for this because I want to get that. I want to get that ring. That invisibility ring is useful. Oi. Let's you here to kick some stiffs. We gotta pass the. Mm, I hope we're checking them for loot first. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. These oh, trash thanks, Whisper. Don't have nothing Is that in Baldur's Gate section? Rocks. Okay. Come on, this is you're good at this. This is one of your things. Perception. Let's, let's find that right. I think if we fail the check, we can't get the right. It's a nice invisibility you ring. Spot a shiny trinket on one of the corpses. Oh, he looks spooky. Okay, similar but different at the same time. Oh, I like his armor. Okay, this is a early access wiver. Well, yeah, early access wiver. Wiver's is old, old look. <laughs> it's it's got a very different vibe to it. I feel like he looks a lot more friendly now. Okay, sleight of hand. We have so many bonuses, Astarian. I know it's a 20, but I believe in you, okay? You can do this. 29, let's go. That's our ring now. <gasps> His eyes glow too. So someone made a mod where you can get the old model of Wivers in your game. Quit sniffing around. Uh, that's in the Discord if anyone's interested. Uh, Whispers posted it in the Baldur's Gate section. <laughs> he looks a little bit like the Grim Reaper. There we go. You finally reached uh, the start of Act 3 and you're on a run so far. Oh, Monks are very strong, yeah. Especially that open hand build. 
When you get those gloves from House of Hope too, just chef's kiss. I think we might, I think we're gonna boop those two. They're just, they're walking XP right now. Nobody's around. No one will notice. Someone. Only Get him. Get him, Shovel. So we had, uh, we had Gale learn the Shovel, um, scroll in dialogue with Shovel while he was a wizard. And then we respect him to a cleric and we still got to keep Shovel. So that was nice. doing welcome yeah nat 20 in the youtube chat if you want to enter the uh the Baldur's gate giveaway today <laughs> oh was a 60 percent you saved against there Oh, we got Carlac. It's on level five. Carlac's a bit squishy for some reason. All right, we'll just move a star in there a little bit because he seems to be. Wait, All right. Let's just help her up. Not a good sign for today, today that. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's gonna be okay. Don't touch me. Mm. I applaud your taste. Oh, I could go for a good meal. Well, when do we get in that four jar? She'll be a little, uh, he's one of those spell sh Yes, yeah, the spell shy. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Shovel's great because uh, you can get that surprise initiative in combat really pretty much guaranteed with Shovel. So that's one of the reasons why we, we wanted to keep him on this run. This run? Uh, no romance has happened yet. We... Uh, Gale did weave us though. We did get weaved by Gale. So as I was saying likely it's gonna be a choice between Halson and Gale for chat. I will let chat choose. Um Because on the Carlac run, we'd probably go with Vistarian anyway, so I feel like that takes her out of the running for this particular one. She's up for the running with Shadowheart though. Cause Shadowheart always talks about how she wants, you know, Carlac to Throw her over her shoulder and whisk her away. <laughs> Deep gnomes killed under the uh, no shops on the food plane. Might have a look in your pockets. They've not got too much. Oh, a lot, a lot of rotten food. We got what we uh, needed, I think. Yeah, that ring. This is what I was after. Oh, we love Barker. So yeah, we must protect. We at uh, so last uh, playthrough, we threw Wolbrin in the ocean. Because <laughs> we had a nice little ceremony, we just tossed him in the sea. Let's go get these two up here as well. Subtle steps. I'm gonna steal the smoke powder from the gnome. I know it's naughty, but we need it later. <laughs> so I'm gonna steal it. My mug's gone dry, stick shit. You heard her, stick shit. Fill her up. 
Uh, Ziggy's getting bullied by a mockingbird. Oh, poor Ziggy. You attacked someone. Only. And then let's just yeet. <laughs> oh, okay. Ding. Nice. Good job, Lazel. Just coming in and crushing it today. <laughs> we also threw Goaty as well. We 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 took Goaty's body and we threw him off a cliff too. Is there a reason why Starry? Oh, oh no 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 no! Because you went first. That's why. All is well. To the death. Um, oh, Wivers? Yeah, yeah, but, uh, so the, the, the fear is that he's durable, yeah, yeah. Which seems to be revealed more at the party, too. Like, the suggestion. Also, where we find him, his connections, um, some of his dialogue options. How you doing, Kip? I hope you're well. Welcome. Oh, we're just showing off the cat scat. Uh, did get it? Mockingbirds do this. Oh, not as much as the blue jays, though. <laughs> they just like teasing the cat. Oh, goodness. All right. Shit! You did it. This little guy's what funny now? too. <laughs> Hmm, go find somewhere to hide and wait for things to cool down. Well, I know a place. Cross the lake. You definitely do Should not want to be safe? around when Won't that near fight happens, guess. So many people end up in the lava. Bet you'll find it handy though. You're a good on my one. test on a run. I it. Um, I just shoved I just shoved near in the lava. <laughs> I was still able to uh, loot him though, because he felt he was really close to the edge. I couldn't get his head, but, uh, I don't know. I was just doing the fight and I just got sick of him. So I just, I just sort of shoved him out of anger. And he went straight in. That's what he gets for hanging out by the edge, though. And this article, while Withers is not named as Jurgle's chosen, he makes the player his chosen and manipulates events to thwart the evil side. So, yeah. Yeah, so basically, you know, the whole game, we're just being manipulated by gods, Let's basically. It's just gods fighting and manipulating mortals to do their bidding. And, uh, Wivers is not an exception to that. <laughs> but it's, it's just so much, right? Monster? They just did such a fantastic job with the writing and the characters. It just blows your mind every playthrough, honestly. <laughs> Phone decided it needed oh, extra no. flair. Yeah, exactly, Ghost. Yeah, yeah. So uh, the, the, people would always, you know, early on it was kind of assumed that he was. And then I think it was like further confirmed with the epilogue as well. But he was in fact Jirga. Who has alert? I think it might be Lazel. So we should probably send in Lazel first for the goo goo. Methinks she's not going to get supplies. Oh, I have the, oh, I have the potions. Oh, I can just take the... Oh, wait, no, no, no. I can take the potion. Okay, uh, Gale and Starring can take the potion. Let me just hold Karlak back. Yeah, okay, we're going to do that. I'm not sure it should be quite so right. Food and Probably pick up that silver on the way out. We can sell it. 
There's a lot of stuff we have to buy at the shops this playthrough, so... We're gonna need that money. That means poor Withers is gonna get pickpocketed a lot, too. Because we get our money back from respecking from him. Well, well. A loose stone. Right, Gale, get get over here. Or maybe shovel too. Yeah, yeah. Penguin huddle. What a day. Right. I think we can do this with this one. <laughs> okay, uh, we're gonna group. Group. But not Carlac. This one. Oh we can't! No! Okay, never mind. Nope, nope, nope. It does not have a circle. So we can't, can't do that. Uh, okay, we'll just have a starry and take it, and then, okay, Gail, you're staying behind. Lazel's with me. Tricks. Gonna try and get a starry in position first, if we can. Looks like an ambush. Oh, we also perceived the ambush already, too. Get him up here. All right, then we're gonna get Lazel in. Just running. Oh, I don't think they- oh, okay, they didn't get surprised because of the perception anyway. Ended up being fine. Can we- can you halt Goo? Yes, you can. Not tried it on them before. Hey, Zior, how you doing? I hope you're well. Enjoy your lurk. Ding! It's not a very powerful thing. I almost fainted for a second, thinking you could, uh, yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> Be nice, right? There's quite a lot of things we can. And sadly, that's not one of them. Makes sense with, you know, alert being a feat and everything. Oh, a starion. They didn't, eat, they didn't perceive him. Probably gonna sneak attack him. Nice and easy. <laughs> yeah. Go on, you can finish it off. Yes. Keep guessing. All right. So far, so good. Bring Carla in. She can't uh, quite get close enough right now. I don't think she can do that from here. It's already going to be halted for one. I am fury. I am death. Okay. I've been using command halt a lot in the on a run. I find it really useful. You're excited for the cardinals to be finished nesting in the bush by the front door. You always get the cardinals in as it's more protected nest. Oh, Yeah, especially with spring coming in, right? All the birds will be, uh, will be out. Yeah. Sadly, the bugs, too. <laughs> no, I mean... It's nice to see, isn't it, Aya? Mmm. Ding. Let's so go. we can get out of the way, that, that one up there. Let's have him... Jump a little closer. See if he can reach now. Yes, he can! Oh, but he missed. In the end, it didn't matter. Give it a schmite. Nice! May the dice roll in my favor. I'll bring Gail in. Gail might be able to halt it again. Yep. 75%. Pretty good, pretty good chance. It's so good. Um it, it was my tactic against the Beulet as well, because the Beulet, you know, if it has a chance to hit you, it can, you know, it can easily wipe out a team. 
Uh, but if you can successfully command halt it, you can kill it that first time you see it, if you're lucky. So you don't have to deal with it later. Sadly doesn't work on the undead. She can reach. Ding. Creator, destroyer. Let's try that. Eighty percent. I think that's the highest I've seen Sundered Flame at. Eighty percent. Just pick up the stuff here first before we uh, head out. And then we're gonna. We're gonna try and take the smoke powder barrel and the smoke powder that she has on her from the no, if we can. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see if we get lucky there. Hey, how you doing, Angelina? Hope you're well. Welcome. How's it going? So we'll have... Ooh, who should we have talked to her this time? Maybe Gail. We'll have Gail talk to her. I'm doing all right, thank you. Yeah, not too bad. <laughs> We're just well into the way out of our on a run now. Okay. Send Galen. And Gail will distract her. Alright, we're just gonna leave. I'm gonna go back to Starion. We're gonna turn invisible. We're gonna just we're gonna just sneak around, sneak around the back. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Just sneaky sneaky. Alright, got that. Let's have a rummage. Pretty good chance of picking that up too. Right. Ash and scent fills the air. Job the done. barrel is filled with smoke powder. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Okay. We'll have, we'll have Gail try to de-escalate. I know what you are. One of Nia's I don't think she's noticed yet. Sailed right in. Better to die in this shitty than rotting moonrise. You want me? Come get me. Hmm. Yeah, She's gonna be a little me. pissed when she figures out, um, <laughs> figures out we've taken the stuff, though. Hmm. You're not so blind, hand in death, but you might still what serve him you? in life. You. You know nothing of me, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I think she might know just now. Shit. I can't do it. Go on. Drag me to Moonrise. I'll make you cult nutters suffer. Hmm. <laughs> She's gonna. I don't want you, but I'll I'll take that smoke powder though. You want to barter with rune powder? Look, you have no idea what you're dealing with. Any true Iron Hand would trade their life for a grain of this stuff. <laughs> you just see a star in sneaking in the cutscene. <laughs> My head's in the way, but he is, he, you can, he's right here. Hang on. Um, if I move my camera just for a second, you'll be able to see him. He's, he's right. 
You see? He's right there. <laughs> Just sneaking behind her. Um, you always get nervous when anyone gets to this part in the order and she can't blow us up if it's not there. Josie, thank you so much um, for the super chat there. I appreciate it. Thank you. Mm, very generous of you. He's gone. You damned rat. I knew I couldn't trust you. <laughs> um, <laughs> Gail's just like a star, Ian. What did you do? Unfortunately, she's she's a little bit angry about that. I don't think she yeah she didn't see a star in at all there. He went super undetected. Right, that's that, and we got uh, we got that vial of smoke powder that we can use uh, later. There's going to be casualties this on a run. Um, I don't, as far as I'm aware, they don't, they won't find out. <laughs> Sorry, Gail, distract her. I have a plan. Gail, is it a bad plan? Astarian. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, last time it was Will who had to put up with his antics. This time, uh, uh this time it's poor, uh, poor Gail. <clears throat> So last playthrough, I used the uh, I used the the, the smoke powder on oh on um we used it on Raphael and we we did a dome a protection dome and just blew him up. Uh huh. Let's go back there. We'll sell a couple of things. Probably need to do a rest before we bring out near, I think. Hey game, how you doing? Happy Sunday. I hope you're well. We simply Welcome, Chocolate. Dig. Hope you're having a good one today. How's it going? See what you've got. All right, we'll just sell a couple of things. Mm -hmm. We didn't do... We gotta do that part as well. Right, first... We'll take a rest. Yeah, 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 Rogue Ranger. Oh, we gotta go give Shadowheart... The statue of Shaw as well. The goblins still infest the roads. As long as their leaders live, Zevlor's people are trapped. Hmm. Oh wait, that's not sh <laughs> That's Will. That's not Shadow Art. I don't think there'll be any more trouble between Lazelle and I, if you were wondering. We can all sleep easier now. <laughs> well, that's good. Apart from all Always the makes rest. me a bit nervous, that part. Hmm. Yes. 
that's good. I'd rather keep things friendly you between us. Interesting definition of friendly, but yes. I I'm trying to remember which that comes. It's one of the camp outfits, I think. Mm, I can have a look in my stash in a moment. I've forgotten the name of the mod. Mm, I found this idol of Shah. Yeah, maybe you might want it. You've, you've thought of me. Thank you. It's beautiful. I'll find a place of honor for it. We'll we'll rather keep her happy so we don't Nobody's lose her in Act Two. Given me anything before. What do I owe you in return? Hmm. <laughs> Golden riches will do nicely. Empty out that purse. I'll settle for a thank well, you. In that case, thank you. I'll always it seems saying that sarcastically, I though. After I think of Lady Shah, of course. I wonder. Perhaps this is connected to the Dark Justicias. This isn't the first sign we've come across. It can't just be a coincidence. They had a presence in these lands once. I should keep watch for more signs. Mm. Very well. Let's see if we find anything Thank in the future. You. I should have known you'd be understanding. Big and angry and booping lots of Sharons. Hi, welcome. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Okay. Oh, we got to take... I think we found some iron as well, so we got to take that... ...to Damon as well at some point. Before... ...we do the Grove versus... ...the Goblins. Before he runs off. Okay, uh, let me have a look at that mod name for you. I remember which... Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll probably knock her out, I think. I think it's... It's not that one. It's not that. Pack of cloves? Ah! I think it's this. I think it's pack of cloves. It should be on the mod list. It's one of them on the mod list. <laughs> Not sure if that was the actual name of the mod, though. Uh, but it's nice, yeah. Yeah, it looks very... The outfits look completely different on... Uh... Uh, the body types. I think that that one was mostly made with the um, the feminine body types in mind. I think that mod. Hi, Debbie. How you doing? I hope you're well. Welcome. How's it going? I hope you're good. Okay, so we're gonna try inside with the Dwega if we can. First, we're gonna give her the boots. <laughs> so many fashion choices. There's some great clothes mods on Nexus, honestly. Spoilt for choice. Little pricks do when we strap fire to their legs. Charming. He's doing all and right. He's still got his hair. <laughs> Move, Hoon. I don't have time for drugmen outsiders. Hmm. Oh, you better make time for a true soul. Stairs, but it's a mere tickle. You hear no thoughts or memories, just an echo of just scars cut to the chase. Never healed. A true soul, eh? Useless wreck. The hair's growing on you. Me. It's Glad quite fabulous hair. Responsibility. Tunnels collapsed. Best hair in camp. Trapped true soul near. He's stuck in there with poisoned geezers. We don't get him out soon. It's both our heads. Mmm. Am I? I'm wearing the boots. Why can't I give her the boots back? Hmm. 
I've got some explosive powder, that should do the trick. That's so. Is it because I'm wearing them? Oh, maybe she's not... She might not be registering them because I... Hang on, if I take them off. Is it because I transmog them? Maybe because I transmog them, she's not registering it. Let's reset them. Go on up. Oh, oh, okay. That well, that's broken. I was gonna get that Kashigo thing, but she's she's not acknowledging that we have her boots at all. That's a bit of a problem. Let's give him to Gale. First time I've had that not work. Mmm. Because if we're gonna have a monk, but nope, she's not gonna register it. Oh well. Can't go back, because it's on a mode, so unfortunately that's just one bug we're going to have to deal with. I've had them transmogged before and they worked, so I'm not entirely sure what happened there. It's weird that. What now? Mm. It's the same? Well, no, his hair's better. <laughs> hmm. So we encountered our first honor mode bug. <laughs> it was not being able to give the hand in the boots. No, we don't need to. Go on already. Uh, Go on already. She just, she's just not gonna register it. Seen her run with a barrel under her arm. Right, hopefully one. we can get them on Enough side. The drow out. Someone should grab it. Slaves are never going to manage with pickaxes. Can't go chasing maybes. The sergeants are ticket in. Oh, would you look at that, Kerr? Someone's having a listen. A shiver runs through you. Your mind is awash with The will have told you about yesterday's must-have. He's so Too cute so with his little tail. Mess. What do you think, Kerr? Should his we take me as of him? Uh, we're rolling it at the end of stream, so you got all stream to enter. Hmm. Hmm. I want Nia out, and it sounds like you have a I lead. I parlaying with more twat souls. And you got the stench. If I didn't know better, I'd say a mind flayer shat a worm in your brain. Should split your Not head my choice. And poke around in there if you lot don't pay up. Uh, a stench ridiculous. I'm no more a true soul the than you are. Turns. This time it's colder, sharper. The stench don't lie. You're one of them. Okay, here, here, here's where the dice rolls are coming into play. I was a true soul. That cult lied to me, and now I want revenge. Little fib. Hmm. Revenge, eh? In that case, I got a proposal. <gasps> He's got what little teethling fangs as well in that mod. Oh. <laughs> Missed opportunity, uh, Mazora. Hmm. And what gold? I thought you hadn't been paid yet. Oh, he's got a shop. Oh, he's not got much. <laughs> Ain't my gold I'm offering. It's the true souls. Thrins after the absolute glory. That's why she's got those slaves digging for Nia. But we ain't need glory. Just coin. And Nia's got plenty. Help Thryn free Nia. Then you and my chums grind him okay. up. Okay, so we pretty much Whatever got him outside. Spoils, 
we'll drop you a fight card. We'll see if we can get more gold. You win. Mm, rogue persuasion. Oh, I'm worth more than a cut. I want half. It's a ten. Come on, Astarian. Twenty-five. Half. You drugnin. <laughs> Fine. Half it is. But first, we need to take care of something. You've seen that weird orb I floating about? Okay, I've got a uh, knife. It and don't uh, scroll get for that. The cult watches through it, and we can't risk more twat salt showing up. You still standing about? Get on it. Okay. Mm, we got the explosive Good. powder already. Drop it near the rubble when it's time. Flaming arrow or some sort Aww. of setting off. Is it just a? Do you get a lot of wild bunnies there? You're hogging my hair. Uh, no, sadly, it doesn't do a confirmation in chat. Unfortunately. Okay, we're gonna use the thunder scroll against it and just hope for the best. I gotta make sure we don't mess this up and accidentally aggro the entire place because we only have one shot at it. Let's be quick. Just like tones, make sure. Do we have a shatter? Okay, we have a shatter as well, just just in case. Something it doesn't die from the first hit. Ready or not. Oh, come back! It's a little. Come on! Come on, little orb! Come on, come down here! That's right, come down here. Yeah. No, 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 no! Ah, sugar! Ah. Boo. It's got one elf left. Oh, but it didn't. Okay, that's weird. It didn't actually call anybody. Um, okay. Alright. That's odd. I think we're gonna have to use the shatter. Oh, just get out of that. Come here. Ah, ah, come back, come back, come back. <laughs> oh my goodness, this isn't going well. Right, okay. <laughs> I didn't want to use both of those, but... Kept running away. Right. They're not really a problem to get rid of later, it's just early on. We don't do as much damage and it's resilient to quite a lot of things. <laughs> Apparently they didn't care. We got lucky. We got really lucky. Because <laughs> I honestly thought that was going to start a fight with the whole place. Oh, I got bunnies under the shed as well. You want to call him Stew? Oh, you want to call the bunny Stew? You got a name for a mama bunny here. A toddler came up with mommy bunny. And that's the name she's got. Oh, I haven't really seen any wild rabbits here, but I, I'm in the city, so. Okay, we gotta make sure. So, right, Lazel's gonna take a potion. Carlette's gonna take a potion. Gale and Starry are gonna take some psychic resistance, because I think. I think Nier has some psychic thingy. I just wanna... Oh, 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 I meant to throw it. But instead I drank it. I was gonna just toss it and then uh, get the two in one, but it's fine. Thankfully I bought more than one. Okay. Well... Where do we want everybody? Of you lot is getting tossed to a rope and eat. 
Aww. <laughs> it sounds nice though, Aya. Just gonna make sure we've got everything we need. Spirit guardians. That's not really useful here. Can't be charmed. He does a thing where you turn. Does that light count as charmed? Just in case. <clears throat> I'm gonna respect Carlac. Her abilities oh are a bit of a mess. I think they're still the default. <laughs> Fate spins along as it sh Dost thou require an as Um, okay. Oh wait, no, it's definitely not her fault. Um, that doesn't matter too much right now because we're using the potions anyway. And then ideally... Don't know, oh, we need that for the wisdom saving throws. gonna bring her strength down because she's using the potions anyway so we can't get it to 16 all right I put it in decks Uh, still go with vengeance. Yeah, do that. Neo is pretty easy to hold. That's good. Get an absolute ton of wild berries as well. Ah, yeah, probably came for the food, right? Yeah, his legendary isn't bad, it's just a bit tedious sort of waiting for either someone else to hit him or for it to go away. Um, what did I give her before? I think she had a lure. Oh wait, no, no, no. We're, uh, I'm giving her two levels of fighter right now. Yes, I think that's gonna be good against, uh, we wanted to hit her a little bit more. When we get to the forge. So we'll get that now. It's the Doom Hammer. The Doom Hammer. <laughs> Where is the star? Right, is that? Okay, we're gonna put a starion up here. Spider can stay there. And if we're lucky, we can just chuck him off. <laughs> That's kind of the plan. Make shovel invisible. Where's Carla? Oh, Carla, what's she doing at it's camp? <laughs> Carla decided she didn't want to come. And you better hope that's the worst. Well, Carla up front. Enough waiting. I close out. Just on Gale somewhere here, yeah. Just got 
two misty steps. I'd love to, thanks. Direct me. I think it's probably gonna be fine. Thanks, have some fun. Love Gale do the powder. Oh, Carlite might want to. <laughs> she might want to get out of the way. Quite ready for you. I might have to use the star in Spyball. Good show. One more. Ah, excellent choice. My pleasure. Blast the data bits! Oh, it didn't set on fire Don't despite being it. around the fire. Interesting. Okay, right, we're just gonna have Yeah, make sure a star ends there. And then Gale here. Carlac in. Right. Let's go. Carlac, come back. You can blame it all on me. I'm not sure why she didn't leave with us. Finally. Oh, a star ends upstairs but downstairs Worthless at the same time. He's just magical like ruined. that. Nair does not fail. Hmm. We, we, so I'm pretty sure Barkus dies if we don't say this. You so we have to, uh, yeah. We don't, we don't want Barkus to die. So. <laughs> Most curious. Hmm. Oh, this isn't about them. I just can't stand your face. <laughs> and yet you came to my aid. A test. Yes, you must be. <laughs> the absolute. You to try yeah, he's gonna boomerang uh, back, hopefully, Friend, after the cutscene. Carve out his heart. It's because it prioritizes it the, the main if character it now. Before it would just do whoever's closest, soul, but now it it prioritizes it us, which sometimes thing. doesn't make sense based on where we're standing. Hi, Shane. How you doing? Hope you're well. Welcome. How's it going? You gotta put some work in. Gathering intel from a distance is most important, right? It's a shame we didn't get the Kashigo thing, but it's okay, because there's, like, better stuff later for the monks, so. Mmm, this is your cue, uh, Briffa. Time you Damn got paid. Right, time. And does too. My crew are ten days worth of coin near, and the reckoning's come. You bargained with this wretch. How vexing. Let Nia have it. It's <laughs> not without mercy, true soul. The rat has given you a chance to earn my favor. Strike him <laughs> Get down. that coin. <laughs> Prove your faith. Right, we're going to side with the rebels. Heretics. Why? Do, Carl, like, disapproves regardless of what you do. Um, hey, Boba. How you doing? Hope you're well. Welcome. How's it going? I hope you're good. Well, there's nobody near the... Lava we can yeet yet. Oh, that wasn't good. Welcome! Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. She does, yeah. Yeah, she disapproves either way. Hard to please for that one. Nice. One down. Right, Carlax. Could we follow, baby? Where's Nia? Oh, we'll probably get we'll get Gale to do that. Ding.
shovel. Just silly can't push poor shovel away there. And then Starion's not even in. Surprise! <laughs> pretty well that <laughs> okay get, then we're gonna get Gale to uh oh really straight away there four is that a wisdom thing um a oh, wisdom save um can't be, she's charmed, right? She's charmed. So if I do this, she shouldn't. Yeah. Okay, right. That's what I thought. That's why I put that on there. I was like, I'm pretty sure I do something that counts as charm, so. All right. Stand near the law, but they're just asking to be poached. He's like, no, no, he has like, he, I don't. Does he even need to go to a barber? He, he just wakes up and his hair's perfect, right? You glad to see near? You, you just you good as long as near gets a good thrashing. Oh. <laughs> Nice. I don't think he's got the visage on right now. Okay, now he's got it. Taking position. Oh really? We can't can't shove them from there? Seriously? Oh, that's no fun. Oh, honestly. I wanted to shove them. <laughs> ah, they're in a weird position. Do it with a bow. Let's spill some blood. I think I have to hold him before. Up. Otherwise, they'll probably bounce back. Is my guess. Oh, sweet. <laughs> mm, it's just near, really, that we have to deal with. I'm gonna try it just because I'm curious, but I've got a feeling it's gonna count as him being struck. Yeah, yeah, all right, that's what I thought. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted to test it. Hi, Darby! How are you? Welcome, I hope you're doing good. How have you been? Mm, now we do it. He's held. Now they're probably gonna go hit near and we just gotta make sure we don't get too close. So 
someone's invisible. Oh, she's invisible. Um, I don't know. I don't know if he did. I don't think he... It, it counted as hitting him, I believe. If we're lucky, he's not going to do well against saving out of that, and he's just gonna get stuck for a long time. <laughs> oh, never mind, doesn't matter. <laughs> doesn't even matter. Basically, it's basically dead. Watch this. Lucky. During a fight. Yeah! During a fight. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna wait for the invisible one to pop up. I think she might be somewhere here. Nope, no she's not. I think if she was, it would have gone off there. Aww! Thank you, Cal! <laughs> Oh, who's our favourite? You see it? Cock stench had a regular in his skull. That uh, the glyphs came All in handy anyway. To clear out. Wait, was it, did Grab I pick up his gear, head? Was, was his head in the inventory? I didn't notice Time that. I scrammed before more <laughs> pricks from Moonrise Towers <laughs> moving. Skipped a gnarly cutscene if that was the case. Oh, that's a first. I don't think I've seen that before. Maybe it's because I did it in the combat. Curious if we get the cutscene or not now. Maybe not. Mm, and the gold. Someone's gone picking my pockets, you chaff. That what? I that wasn't me. You want coin? There's plenty of corpses to sell. <laughs> it literally wasn't me. Hmm. <laughs> Very well. You do that. Hmm. What about the uh, the slaves? What about Clan them? Property. We don't want him taking those. They come with us. I think it happens when he's ah, oh, the, the body gets damaged or they burned. Because then the, the oh, that guys. makes okay, that kind of makes sense. Yeah. Mm. Let the gnomes go. We'll just slow you down. Likely to be all hobbled hey Joe, up how are you? Hope you're doing well. No pricks, you're off the hook. The killing blow set him on fire. So, so basically, if the senses. body's in a condition where you couldn't use talk to the dead. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what makes Moonrise Tower such you're a frat? Brain going mushy, shark. That's where those absolute. Uh, are what arc? Goblins. Drow, We're doing our gnomes, and an Astarian honor run right and now. No one, they won't try to turn. The way I hear tell, some just at Grimforge. The, shots. the general near called him, and there ain't no way I'm sticking around long enough That's to meet him. Okay. Might boot them too. We could do it. We could boot them as well. Uh, mm -hmm. So yeah, does Carla just have? Yeah, she does. So she's already got the head. Give those to Astarian. I'm here. A quick rummage. Oh, they're not gonna like it if I uh rummage through the body. Okay, I think we're gonna boot away. Oh, oh, we should probably talk to Barkus. We're gonna make. I'm gonna make sure Barkus gets to camp first. 
Yeah, yeah, just an early act one right now. Suffer. Just well, around the Underdark. You did it. I shouldn't be surprised considering our history. I like that they have, um, yet... you know, most things. There is a, there is a workaround, you know, uh, Violet. <laughs> like, this isn't one of those games that breaks if you kill a certain NPC that they didn't expect you to kill. They're, they fought about... There, there is some implementation in place for that 1% of player who did that weird thing. <laughs> mm -mm. Don't sound so surprised. Nothing good happens in the Underdark. <laughs> I don't know if you've heard, but some of the Iron Hand gnomes, my friend Wulbrin among them, have been taken prisoner in Moonrise Towers. And so, to Moonrise Towers I go. Hmm. Iron Hand gnomes, I recognize that name. They fight for gnomish recognition in the city, has right? to do with freedom and everything to do with power. I told Walbrin not to go near Walbrin. them. Walbrin! Did he listen? He did not. Hmm. The first things first, you look exhausted. You should rest Certainly our camp. Not. In case you haven't because been I'm pretty sure he'll get himself killed if he doesn't. Has been taken captive. Sacrifice Gale me. to Bual. Um. I don't think it breaks. I think he, he just gets really pissed, doesn't he? And then he may, he asks you to res him. Hmm. I suspect I'll be rescuing you a third time then. I was unlucky twice. Walbrin is such a bongle, right? Boo, again, boo, wow. Oh, we haven't gone there yet. We got to do that. Give me time to think. Hmm. Hmm. Fine. Show me where to go, and I'll try my luck. I'll have a better chance oh, of rescuing Walbrin if I'm at my best. Mm. And, um... Surprised they haven't patched that out yet, then. <laughs> okay. I just wanted to make sure Barkus was safe. Wait. Before we did anything... Dangerous. Okay. It's my job. Let's go in. Hey. Just get Sanitation. everybody in position. We're gonna boot them too. Because why not? <laughs> See, Shovel agrees. Oh, stop missing Carlac. This is being, being bad. She could finish him off. I really like taking the weapons off them. Yeah, so we just finished Nier, and we're we're going for the rest of him now. Oh. Maybe shovel can. Yeah, good job, shovel. We should be pretty fine in this fight. Ooh. I 
that over there. <laughs> we will, but you know, we might as well get that XP, Glenn. Hi, Daniel. How are you? Hope you're doing well. Welcome. How's it going? I hope you're good. Remember the first stream of yours I saw and you played the... Oh my goodness, was that the first time? <laughs> when we started the stream playing that F. Wilburn Bongle song. Whoa! Wow, she got absolutely smashed there. Unexpected. She's kind of squishy for some reason. A squishier than she kind of should be. Love Gail, bring her back. Hey, cat. Oh, no worries. Um, for YouTube, yes, because there's no way for us to DM people. Um, so you're gonna have to. Uh, but yeah, it'll be at the end of stream, so don't worry. You've got time to have your dinner and come back, so don't worry, cat. Yeah, it's just it's a bit more complicated on YouTube because we can't uh, message people. <laughs> it was great, and I knew then I had to stay. <laughs> That's such a good song. <laughs> the one thing that Baldur's Gate players can unite um, with is their hatred of Wolverine Bongle. <laughs> Yeah, that was kind of like where my Twitch journey started out with Fallout. <laughs> they did a- oh, they did an anti-Apple rap recently as well. Oh! Oh, just shove him. Oh. Oh, it was red. Apparently I can't shove him over the candle, bruh. Yeah, she's a... well, no, Lazel's just a fighter right now. I'm gonna make her the monk, I think. Um, Karlax, the paladin fighter. I do find paladins miss more than fighters. Early on, especially. So usually if I'm making a paladin fighter, I give him, like, fighter ranks for one to three, and then I go into paladin, or, like, one to two. So I just find that they miss more early on. Yeah. I was thinking it might make more sense with Lazel to go like Gift Monk, yeah. You love you love her, the Apple song's really good. I think they released it this week, didn't they? You just wish uh Baldur's Gate had text chat so you could play with friends. Ah well I mean you can always use uh like Discord when you're playing with your friends. Do like a voice chat with them. Um, but yeah, yeah, no, it would be nice if there was if there was a way of doing that though, because the accessibility, not everyone can communicate via voice chat, so you could argue it's an accessibility issue. Mm. We can take all the things now. Oh, maybe the gnomes... I don't know, maybe the gnomes won't be happy about it. Oh no, the gnomes don't care. <laughs> the gnomes are like Sodom. We never liked them anyway. Oh, they might be a bit... Oh no, they don't care. I was technically stealing that one, but I didn't say anything. No, 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 no. We're no, we're, we're saving the gnomes. Gosh, this is a evil dirge run. <laughs> oh goodness! If we romanced Gale and then he did that, it'd be 
We'd probably get one of the worst endings ever, I guess. I don't know. I haven't decided yet if we're going to do that or not. I haven't decided. XP makes dirges of us all. Mm. <laughs> We've been pretty good so far. A miracle mask, no less. Hell's foot soldiers. Underway. Wait, no. Oh yeah, yeah, he's missing his head already. Right. That went relatively well. I'm your husband. It's my job. Ready and willing. I wouldn't have ready. Mmm, we need to convince Carlac What's to take the tadpole. Copper for your thoughts. He tells says hello. <laughs> Astarian is a pretty princess, that's true. Um, there's a lot of orange and red on the screen. Oh no. Oh, it's cause we're in oh, it's cause we're in the forge. We're basically near a volcano. Oh, Divinity did have text chat. Maybe it's something they'll add later then. Yeah. Maybe they'll add it eventually. You need to play Divinity... So with Divinity 2, we can also do multiplayer like uh, Baldur's Gate then, it seems. Your roommate wants you to play with him. Aww. I, I got it on a sale and I need to do a playthrough at some point. We could do that on stream if it's something people would like to see. Um... Ooh, what am I looking for? Mm. So about our tadpole really powers. Do, huh? Not worried about yeah, we're gonna. Get, into the last run, I was able to convince well, everybody. What can I say? You look fine, smell fine, seem fine, and yet you're more mind flayer than ever. No tentacles. <laughs> That's the important thing. To follow your lead in this. Hmm. I was hoping you might. The benefits seem to outweigh the costs. Plus, no tentacles. I'm not sure either of us can say one way or the other. We don't know what the costs might be just yet. Mm hmm. Hmm. We might be facing a cult more powerful than we know. We need all the help we can get. Good, good. Mm. Wanna start tadpoling him up. How do you do that? Always making sense when I He does have puppy dog time. eyes, and I, I like to think he used them on Carlac yeah. here. I'll keep an open mind, you know that look right? he gives you when he's trying to make you um, do yeah. so. Do, tab do here. something Tav probably wouldn't otherwise do. <laughs> uh, ooh, ooh, okay, we'll send all those to camp. Lots of food. Okay, so now we can start tadpoling Karlak up. I'm your husband. It's my job. I wouldn't have it over there. What's in here? I heard a uh, Missouri's actress actress is in uh, Divinity Two. Someone said yesterday she plays the bard. This. Oh, lovely little pick me up. Right to the forge now, and then we'll uh, we'll get to the uh, the big boss. I like how the rest of the Dway guards have absolutely no idea what happened. The true soul. Well, let's see what you've got. They just seem completely oblivious to it. Okay. 
He's also just offloading some stuff. Best. Oh, spider. <laughs> Who's the statue you think? Human. God. We'll probably take out the lava monster. Pretty easy with the ill matter arrows. Stops it from healing. It, yeah, it's a little different, but there's it's it's definitely got its perks, right, game? Everyone over there said the way it pauses is slightly different too. Uh, but yeah, it is uh, to enter the giveaway today. It is uh, it is via YouTube. Uh, this one, as that's our new main hub since they. Uh, Shut Twitch career down, sadly. <laughs> it's just, it's just chilling. Come on, everyone. Let's see if I can remember. Oh. Remember which one it is? I think that might be up. Yeah, that's up. We don't want that one. aggressive hurry up and wait walk <laughs> I mean I feel like he's impatient by nature is he gonna what was that nope <laughs> looks splendor I'm sure that's Cast very light. useful if you know what it means alas I don't You can also just lockpick it too. That also works. <laughs> and disarm. We're only gonna get the armor. The weapons become obsolete a little too quickly, so. I'm gonna get the medium and the heavy, I think. A mold of some sort. Brilliant. Now to find the forge you belong to. Welcome! Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Leave no tricks. You have my attention. I have Gail over here. Not the wrong man for this. Steady. I love how Gail's just like, I don't do sneaking. Time for a little dip. What the fun? Where's shovel? Why am I doing this? Let's have shovel go in and uh, see if we can surprise him. Oh no, never mind. I think this all call out. I will ascend. You like the shield? Yeah, the shield's not too bad as well. Like I've gotten that a few times. I think we're just gonna focus on armor this one though. Starion didn't get seen. They won't see me nice. Oh, but he rolled a... Swift and not a great initiative there. His knees are bad. <laughs> Oh, 
better. I appreciate it. Okay, she might this time. <laughs> Appreciate it. A whole gaggle of Merigons. They never fight alone, though. Oh, shovel? Where's oh, for sure. <laughs> How to keep shovel happy? Just let shovel murderize people. No, you'll have a very happy shovel. Rested key. Though. Whatever commanded them. Oh, letter. I'm not sure it's dead. Oh, the one from Sybil. Don't mind if I do. Uh, might be worth doing. We'll, we'll do a rest and then we'll we'll boop the imps and the fire monster and then we'll do an rest and then we'll do the forge <laughs> and gail's still sneaking at his tent yeah let's get the next pee before we uh before we fight he's still sneaking I do gail you don't need to sneak anymore it's fine what do you need hmm if you ever feel this never ease magic taking over you, you what will you do that? If I ever know I am no longer able to stop it. Shovel says I'm gonna eat your do babies. I don't think I've heard Shovel no say that yet. That's intense. For my mistakes. <laughs> I will find the but it doesn't surprise me, but you know. <laughs> Sounds very shovel. Welcome. Thank you for I the follow. I appreciate death. it. Hope you're having uh, oh, a lovely day today. I promise I will not betray your trust. You kept me by your side despite the menace that I am. If worse comes to worse, you feel like that's a bit tame for Shovel. <laughs> Um, are there any? Oh, um. So people have told me if you like if you like the streams over there, that really helps uh, push them out there. So whenever you you go, um, you're watching over there. If you like the stream, apparently it helps. It's funny. Ah, when you use scare, <laughs> I mean that'll do it. <laughs> Copper for your thoughts. Mm. Oh yes, we've already found some infernal iron. As good as he seems. Once my engine's handled, I can focus on more important matters. Ooh. Tadpoles. Piece of hair's got a mind of its own. Frosty pints. Mm. So not only do you have this thing in your chest, it's also burning up. That's the short of it. Bloody thing's been in overdrive since I left Avernus. At least we can save her this time. <laughs> The when we did the origin run, the worst part about um the spawn of Starian ending was not being able to save Karlak. I was worried about it the entire playthrough, and then because we disappeared before that scene happened, Will did not suggest going to the hells. Uh, the funny thing is, he suggested going to the hells after she blew up, but not before, so we were quite upset with Will after that. 
<laughs> we, um, because we romance Will that run. And he doesn't, he doesn't really offer to take her to Avernus, the problem is, if, if, you know, your main character's not there. But he did, um, in their sort of romance ending. We got some infernal metal. I guess we got to take it to Daniel. Daniel told us to look out for this stuff. It was right? so frustrating, Let's Daniel. Go find him. I was like, Carlac -like literally blew up, and now you want to go to hell? <laughs> Honestly, we almost broke up with him over that. <laughs> All right. Let's go deep. Um, we should be able to, yeah. Yeah. Assuming she stays with us, of Dog course. wags his tail, a small bag clenched between his teeth. Uh, probably Gale or Halson. Chat will get to pick. Right now, Gale's weed does. It was funny, because Will was in the background drinking. <laughs> like he knew. <laughs> Just watching on as his, uh... Ex-husband flirts with Gale in the weave. He gives in and surrenders his find to you. Always pet the doggo. Hey, Elle, how are you doing? Hope you're well. Welcome. I'm just doing our auto mode run right now. He's so cute. <laughs> yeah, he weaves you. Yeah. Yeah, he weaves you under the guise of teaching you magic, but it's actually just a big old flirt. Oh, it didn't. Oh, dear. That's not good. YouTube's usually a lot better with that. Mm. I know if you hit the bell I thank you um, the before the stream account. goes live, um, it for will thinking. send you a notification for sure that. then. Or it's supposed to. What about? It's about Wolbrin. We know he's been taken to Moonrise Towers, and we know <laughs> I'm going to save him. I didn't do anything. Is this. I didn't do anything bad. A preponderance of evidence that I am a terrible adventurer. I'm not sure I should trust Wilbrin's fate to... I did well, change the stream time, me. though, because I originally put it to 6.15am, uh, but um, I didn't really sleep last night, so I was ready early, so I changed it to 6. Maybe when I change it like that, it doesn't send the notifications out properly. As a possibility. That's the only thing I can think of that could have affected it. Hmm. That's why Discord and uh, t Twitter are always the best places to go for going live updates, because you'll get it straight from me then. Hmm. If we ever visit Moonrise Towers, I guess we could mm. look for him. You've done so but you deserve much better Wolbrun. I mean, Barkus. We don't like Wolbrun. <laughs> but I can't risk recapture. Um, I barely escaped yes, last time. yes. Thank you, Whisper. You do. Yeah, liking also helps push the stream out there. I will. That's. <clears throat> I can't promise I won't chuck him in a river interview. later, though. <laughs> Thank you. There's something else you should know. Something I can no longer ignore. Rune powder. Do you know what it is? Other than a valuable explosive, perhaps Until not. Very recently, I thought rune powder We've was stolen a myth. plenty of it, though. A substance so powerful it could fell a city, mm -hmm. a nation. The Iron All the Nat Twenties today have proven the impossible. Rune powder is real, and they have it in their possession. Mm. What do they want to do with it? Destruction. The only thing it's good for. <laughs> Pollute the river. Too much wool. Too much bongle in it. Well. I'm hoping we Wilbrin haven't done it yet. We're rolling us. at the end. I shouldn't end of stream. have let him drift away. Shouldn't have let that lot get their claws into him. Now more than ever, I need to find him. We need to find him. Mm -hmm. He's the only one I might be able to speak to sensibly. <laughs> You're in for a shock. Um. Okay, I'll find your friend, and together we'll stop I by and hand you. gnomes, and I'll but steal all their explosives. Thank you. Aww. <laughs> I appreciate it, Steve. 
Okay, I love how Shovel and um, Barkus are just hanging out. <laughs> They're friends now. Usually Barkus hangs out at Starion's tent, but because we don't have a tent, he's in a different place. I find that interesting. Always kind of hangs out near a Starion. The companion who is always talking smack about gnomes. I like to think that throughout the game he grows to like gnomes and overcome his bias through his friendship with uh, Barkus. <laughs> Oh, I appreciate it, Al. Yeah, for the uh, YouTube giveaways, just gotta make sure you're here at the end. Um, because we can't DM people like we can on Twitch. So it's hard to get into contact with someone who's not, like, there. So that's the only requirement, really. That, uh, well, following and or subscribed uh, rather on YouTube and uh, present. I'm not gonna... Uh, Sent to camp. Shield mall. we can get the Grimforge boss down in one attempt. <laughs> it's just, it's one of those fights where it, c it can go south if we're unlucky. But maybe fine. We're gonna have a star you know, up at the top, so if, if the team dent below get wiped, it'll be fine. Pretty sure you can't get hit up there. Getting a lot of polymorph scrolls. Make good use of them later. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna use the hammer. Need to get a bit closer. Enough waiting. To use laser. Elf. Like the crossbows have got a bit of a shorter distance. You like the details of the spider webs? Yeah, this game has really good details. This thing is all but rusted through. Mm. It's extra safe. Oh, shovel, can you not get up here? Oh, oh poor shovel, he can't get up. We'll have to bring him in a minute. Um. Bring him beer and other means. Oh, I might be able to jump down here. Yeah. How delicious. He just couldn't jump up. place you're there now where does it lead ah um this place leads to the forge where you can make some rather nice weapons but there's also a big boss <laughs> he's got little legs certainly
Keep your distance, darling. Watch the shadows. Hey, Doctor. Thank you. Uh, yep, yep, you can still enter. Yep. It's hashtag net 20. Um, only rules are gotta be uh, subscribed and got to be here uh, at the end of stream when we draw. I got worried for a second there. I, I didn't realize I had triggered that. I was like, what is it? There's not supposed to be anything here. Discord, right, Stripes? Time for discretion. It's more names we're unfamiliar with that it's a bit of an issue with because we, uh, you know, don't have their details to uh, contact. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Ah, okay. Shovel can't, uh... He's got small, tiny... Tiny, tiny legs. Mm, you should be fine then, Stripes, yeah. Because we know how to contact you. Okay. I think they're surprised. Miss. Bad start. Double miss. Yeah, that's better. Eager for battle. Just bring everyone else in. That's not high. Soldier. Toast, toast. Like a vandal. Let's get her closer. Oh, she might be able to go around and... Uh... Swipe. I'll go around and whack this one. She can. As a shortest fencer in my fencing club, I can relate to Shovel. <laughs> oh dear. Nice. Oh, dead. Give uh, Star in a blast just so he can. He's got a better chance of hitting. One left. I don't fancy their chances. Save our spell slots. Oh, there's one more. 
<laughs> I didn't see that one there. Bye! <laughs> no time to waste. Um... Oh, you hit the server limit. How many servers can you be in? I didn't know there was a limit either. Yeah, that was news to me too. Imagine it's fair amount. People hate sparring against me with swords. I've got long limbs and quick. But the four foot eleven girl is a beast, though. <laughs> I did I did a bit of fencing in um, primary school, but they didn't have classes for it at secondary, sadly. A hunt over a hunt, and that yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> it's a lot of sir. How do you keep track of all of them? Oh, see, oh, you've hit it a few times. All right, job done. Quick rummage. Me, <laughs> yeah, I'm in a very small handful as well, Whisper. <laughs> and I can barely keep track of the ones I'm already in. Massive rock. Tiny, tiny bit of mithril. Oh, there's a thingy. Steve he is, he's putting in work. <laughs> he's the glue that holds the team together. Oh yeah, yeah, he's wearing a it's a ranger outfit right now. Nice this one. It's very it's very starring. Okay, we got the medium and the heavy mail now. That's pretty much what we wanted. Getting closer to that forge fight. Might keep the cleric upstairs as well. Okay. We'll do the imps first. I swear he's wearing a white shirt until the point he was digging. Uh, no, no, he's been wearing this all day. There is a white version of this shirt that he has on, though, that we've had in a different playthrough. Um, but yeah, he's not, he's not wearing it right now. It's sort of a blue. Okay, we're gonna just send Lazeland first. Because. Well, hello. Ready or not. And then hopefully they're not gonna get surprised from here. I don't know. They might. Let's bring them further down. And bring Lazel out. Tall people have the advantage of a longer reach. Um, but they have more target area. Short people are harder to hit, but they have less reach. It's so, it, yeah, I feel like it kind of evens itself out, right? Mm-hmm. I agree. Okay. Right, they've all popped out, so it might be safe for them to come in now. Hi, Metallic! How you doing? I hope you're well. Welcome, welcome. gross that noise they make Attention. Oh, okay one of them that's looking over here to get out of the way. 
just in time. Won't be able. I don't think I'll be able to this time though. Just can't get too. Can't get far. Critical miss. Spin crawl like down here. Give it a whack. Then run. Oh, she can't. <laughs> hey, Sunder, how you doing? I hope you're well. How's it going? It was just—he was glowing so much it looked white. Oh, one of the annoying things they can do is make you drop your weapon. Yeah. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. <laughs> I like how, as I said it though, as it just came back to my memory, they immediately made Carla drop her weapon, didn't they? Guess they're annoying. <laughs> Do a sweepy. Oh no, okay, I'm fine. <laughs> My bad, I thought I'd hit one of them. Um, to the point where they were gonna die. I had not. Oops, fine. Was that shovel rolling for sneak there? I think it might be. Make sure we got Lazel in there. Oh, everyone's kind of fine. My turn. <laughs> Pick up your weapon. Uh, uh yeah, yeah. I'll post the link again for anyone who who was. in Twitch as well. Hey, Thiddle. How's it going? Hope you're well. <laughs> well, we'll try not to. Okay, got out of the way that second one. Carlike, you can get your weapon back now. Oh. All right. Just so much fire. to wrestle it a lot this week. To the, the, uh, today. All right, we're gonna go uh, boop that thing as well. So we got plenty of hours of Bill Marta for this part. Seek and you shall find me. Got Gale over here. Larian have come forward and said anything's canonical. No, no, I think it's all just up to the player, really. I mean, I, you'd like to think that the good endings are canonical, you know? 
Like, I like to think that a Starian resisting ascension is canon. That's what I like to think, at least. So many of the characters are so, um, you know, I feel like the player's actions influence them so much that uh, it's kind of difficult to say what would be the actual cannon. Okay, right, he's not going to heal this round. going today. I hope you're good. Yes! You know, Steve's carrying the team. Okay, we're gonna give it another Illmata arrow. I'm not sure if this thing can... is, is okay with the lava. Right, and then we're gonna just spring. Spring shovel around. Okay, give him another arrow. I'll stop it from here. Ah! Slipped away. Raise. It'll stop him from healing. <laughs> no, it's the same one as always. Atomic Munchkin. would too, right? We, we like the, we like him to have a the happier ending. Um, yeah, I guess it's next week, right? We won't know what canonical would be the ending unless we get Bald ba yeah, unless we get Baldur's Gate Four, right? Exactly, yeah. And and e even that will be done by a different company. To be fair, these ended vampires something Larian came up with, so it probably makes more sense for the good ending. Ah, oh, is that true? Mmm, I didn't know that. So it's it's not quite something like if you're a vampire in um, Dungeons and Dragons, it's not quite an option. <laughs> Thanks, Whisper. Yeah, it might be good for us to uh, keep uh, mentioning that to everybody. Appreciate it. You gonna oh, you're gonna get your dailies done later. You making your way up the scoreboard? They did on yeah. Well, I mean, it, it's a complicated situation, isn't it? Um, obviously the layoffs were not good. good. You know, Sven said most of the people they worked with um, didn't make it out of the didn't make it out of that. Yeah. Pretty easy that one, you just gotta That count I guess that counted as lava. Alright. Oh. Nope. Wanna bring him back. Thought he was safe. He wasn't safe. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake! <laughs> oh, <laughs> Toss a potion at him. Oh my goodness! Another stride toward fate. Then make him move. What the heck? <sighs> my goodness. 
apparently he's in this really weird spot where the floor is still lava, yeah. Because technically that should... Okay, let's try now. It's like it just his tiptoes were on it. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's not jump into jump our tiptoes into the lava next time, uh, start. Yeah, he got you did. He got stuck in a weird lava spot, yeah. And that's why I only you know, we only send one in sometimes. Just to be safe. Nah, it's fine. It's just, he just happened to jump into the, like, it's like his uh, heel was on the lava. He's fine. He needed the high ground. <laughs> we don't, we don't need turn base for jumping over here. It's, I feel like it's, it's unnecessary for jumping over here because it's, it's pretty straightforward. It's just, it was just some bad positioning on my part. It holds a subtle warmth. Like he was wasn't dead dead, he was just a little bit. <laughs> we didn't just, you know, he, he had a nap. You feel great power um, to ungrinchify. I actually, you know, I'm gonna be sad when they fix that bug because I'm so used to his little grinch face now. I feel like it's part of him. He was, he was mostly dead. The laugh urge fades. A quiet power spreads from head <laughs> Give to in. head and down to your feet. Thou hast done well. For what is a laugh if not one step toward madness? You love him, Grinch, right? The Grinch face is canon. <laughs> so apparently you don't see it if you're on the lower... Um, Return me! What the mod has said was they think it's some missing LOD for the higher quality textures because if you have it on like medium or low apparently he doesn't do the Grinch face as much. It's like significantly lessened. And that's kind of what the Grinch fix does. It just adds that LOD that is missing. Mm -hmm. What did you do to me? It, 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 it's kind of nice to see him laugh as well, isn't it? But then you remember it's kind of out of his control, and then and then you feel sad again. Honestly, say right, keeping it if they take it out, someone will put it back in again with a mod. I guarantee. Because we're just so used to it now. Let's examine it. It looks like he sucked a candy cane into a sharp point. Forgot it was in his pocket and now it's jabbing him in the leg. <sighs> it's a very beautiful game, yeah. What what kind of car are you on right now? <laughs> Trying to figure out its intentions. Beneath the rampant joy you sense the monk's fear and sincerity. He doesn't wish to harm you. That doesn't mean he won't. Right. Return you to whom? To my granddaughter, Shira Clarwin. Serves Ilmata, she does. She waits in Worms Crossing. Take me there, and thou shalt bathe in her golden gifts. Oh, thou shalt be blessed indeed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll take you to your granddaughter at Worms Crossing. I, I like how if you you have the amulet on for most of your playthrough, he does not stop yapping. This guy, A and D Ryzen or something, the one that came with your laptop. <laughs> Steve, I can't. <laughs> I mean, kinder. I feel like the Grinch face also suits him because um, he is a little bit of a Grinch in personality so you feel a chuckle coming on if you discard it, it do you just throw things. it into the fire i've never done that so but i'm just assuming you kind of do that all right let's not walk into the lava good all right spider new Okay, we're going to... Uh, 
Can I think of where I want to put him? I can't reach it from there. I think we'll have Gale up here too. Yes. Gale got a... Gale needs a... Damn, it's good to be alive. Salutations. Mm. Yes. Usually I can reach the first one with the crossbows. I'm wondering why he can't right now. Yeah, okay, well, Gail can at least reach Watch there. Oh, yes. Let's. Don't think we can stand on that. Trying to figure out any other places we can stand. I feel like this ledge is going to be better. I made him- oh yeah, 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 if he fails a wisdom check he just starts laughing on the floor, doesn't he? Oh, it's old but it's still fighting. As long as- as long as you're at the minimum requirements, it should be fine. What's the story? We're just going to send those two in. <laughs> Shut up! I know you- really grown to like Gale, but... What now? I'm gonna rest first, though. Shh. Step quick. Uh, the only thing you upgraded is your laptop and the RAM. You're gonna get an SSD. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, it makes a difference, the loading times and everything with an SSD. Yeah. Why is there only one sleeping bag? Oh, doggo belly rub time. <laughs> you need a new CPU. Your graphics card is great. Uh, but the CPU needs a little bit of a a little bit of an upgrade. Yeah, some of the game requirements, uh, you know, for the newer games are you know, they're getting pretty pretty intense now. If you want to play at the like higher settings. Okay. What's cooking? Carlac and What a day. Blazel down here. We're gonna keep Gale and stop. No spider, you're down there with them. We'll see how this goes. I think Gale can... I hope Gale can heal from there. Find out. Ah, this is where that mold goes. Hopefully we're on a decent ledge.
And hopefully the forge doesn't bug out. I've had it bug out a couple of play playthroughs. <laughs> so they'll think it's not going to. Alright, when it's down, we'll see what's down. I feel, I feel like he can... He should be able to hit that. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can hit it now it's down. Oh, maybe he would have been fine there then. Um, I'm just gonna give him a jump potion. I'm just gonna see what he can reach from here. Oh, okay, from here he can reach both, right. I have him here, Gale here, because he's gonna focus on healing here. I'm ready. I think it'll still heal them downstairs, right? Right? It looks like it will. Like this one at least. It looks like I can... Looks like I can pretty much reach him. Sell a kidney to get a new rig. <laughs> yeah, with some some of the prices for the graphics card you might have to. <laughs> what about my magic? Okay. I think I think it's gonna be fun. <clears> hmm. <throat> okay, potions, potions, potions. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Gotta make sure Lazel has something bludgeoning. Go with a warhammer. No Give Gale another spell slot. Anything I'm missing. <laughs> um okay, we'll give Lays out what she's probably gonna get hit. Enjoy your dinner. You recommend Lenovo for PCs. They're pretty affordable compared to most. Uh and yours runs really Oh, do they do the setup as well for you too? Um, if you hit the notification bell, it should let you know about the live. Um, if it didn't, then there must have been some error, maybe, sadly. Uh, but you're here now, and that's what matters. <laughs> you can still join the giveaway. We're not, we're not rolling it until the end of stream, so... You are... golden. Oh, I'm a little bit nervous about this one, but... I think it's gonna be fine. We pretty much got a safety net with these two up here. I don't think I need to bring another minion in. Or at least as far as I'm aware, it can't smash me up here. As far as I'm aware. Right. What a Let's just do it. Let's just get it over with. Poor fucker. What did she say? <laughs> Yeah, I thought she said, um, I thought she dropped a death bomb too, yeah. They've been a little unreliable. That's not good. Because uh, Twitches are almost non-existent for me now. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Oh, Lazelle, it would help if you hit. Thank you. <laughs> we need you to actually hit. I forgot to do Gale's spells, but I think I think we're fine. I think, I think yeah, I forgot to say spells, look, but oh, I should have done that. But <laughs> maybe okay. Um, mm, maybe fine. Oh, I didn't put. Okay, I would have put Sanctuary on. That's like 
Oh, too low. Okay, so some things we... He can't hit. This is fine, though. He can heal. He can't bless. But it's fine. <clears throat> oh, we'll maybe bring that later. <clears throat> Reverberate when struck. Ah, when it doubles its movement speed, that's sometimes where it decides to wander from the hammer. I think it's gonna be okay. <laughs> you still want to touch the forge's lava? Um, well, we saw what happened to Starian earlier when his heel step foot in it. <laughs> Some, there's no handrails. I don't think we can become frightened on this fight. That could be useful. Oh, okay. No, nope. they're too far down, apparently. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna have a skippy gale. Oh, gale wasn't. Gale wasn't even in. Yeah, we're gonna. This is my happy place. Oh, I can get Carlac to bless. He's already supercharged, so... Oh, you've been getting the notifications. That's good. Holy shit. <laughs> That's a first. First time I've had, um... That first hit. It'd be so, uh... Hard. Jeez. We better just chuck in a potion at her. Diligence and care. It was a really, it was a really, really big hit. Let's spill some blood. Okay, I was like, is the lava broken? <laughs> I was a little bit worried then. Alright. Um, oh no, it, need, it needs to step in the lava, doesn't it? I was gonna say we could use it as cannon water, but... I'm just gonna keep you here. Oh. No, you don't want to go in the lava, though. Is that gonna... Yeah, that's gonna count as a lava. Oh, it does kind of look like that, doesn't it? Okay, well, I can do that. I know it will attack them. Maybe just let it attack them for a little while. Hi, Doc. How you doing? Hope you're well. Welcome. So Carla, Carla keeps losing her weapon to these things. Second time today. Oh yeah, they care more about that than us. <sighs> right. Mm -hmm. He's not supercharged, so dropping that hammer's not gonna do anything right now. Potion. Oh, she can't misty step. Oh, bonus action. 
Is she? She's not going to be technically be in the lava, is she now? She's fine. You had a good bonk. And then maybe go for one of them. Just need to get rid of him. Oh, sh sh ah, stop! Don't walk into the lava! <sighs> Might have to do this one again. Because, uh, they both decided to walk into the lava. <laughs> That's why we have them at the top, though, just in case something like this happened. Can't leave Carlite walked into the lava too. Let's go. Can you feel death's cold? She she made very poor choices. Um Magnificent. It's fine, because we got these two at the top, so it's not it's not a problem. She just died again. What is she doing? I don't know what she's oh well she's already she's already dead. Oh, it's just off it. Oh well, I got rid of a method. Um Yeah, problem Lazal is in a weird She's in a dumb place. So even if I res her, she's just gonna immediately die. So it's funny because she actually wasn't in the lava when she died, but when she came back to life, she went into the lava for some reason. Um, so that's kind of weird. I'm going to give her a little heal, but I think she's going to die immediately because for some reason she's in the lava. Officially. So it's kind of like earlier where she, like the tiptoes are in. <clears throat> I this. Okay, can Carlac please get out of there? Thank you. Just get out of that. She's probably gonna die from this now. Yeah. Yeah, you do. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake, Carlac. Never had this happen before, so this is new. Just keep him alive there. The men fit dead. So they're both dead. Because they made really bad choices. Um well, Kyle, okay, she's dead, dead. Don't drop it. Pick it up. I have to give her like an. Oh, I can't eat her. Might just have to chuck stuff at it. <laughs> Honestly, that might be the play. Good show. Let's turn someone inside out. I don't think he's on the hammer, is he? I'm gonna just do a test. I'd argue his foot's on it, but the game says otherwise. All right, um, we can't even disengage. You can take a potion. I can, if I give her an invisibility potion, she can get out of the way. In theory. Put him up. Okay. Incoming. And uh and it's gonna come back after us though. She's probably gonna die again. Uh oh we can't scum save, it's on a mode. <laughs> that 
press the hammer. Oh no, can't he can't give her one. Like, it could be worse. I really just gotta get her out of the way. And then that back on there. I don't think I can... Oh, maybe it's, it's better to bring Lazel back. Take Funny fact, she went straight back into lava then. You might be able to just whack both of them. Um, yeah, he... he, he on, so on the legendary effect, he does move a little faster too. Is, I think this is the messiest one I've had yet. Certainly. But we should be. I think it's gonna be okay. Let's have some Can I toss it up? <laughs> Um, well, that worked. <laughs> Let's have a little fun. I think I'm just gonna chuck stuff at it. I think that I think that might be our play. Toss stuff at it and it lays out. I swear, if you go into that lava one more time, we're gonna have some serious words. We, um, we can't be doing that. <clears throat> okay, we got a misty step scroll, I think. He's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. This should work. It doesn't seem to be able to actually do anything to me up here, so I'm just gonna keep chucking stuff at it. That's that's my plan. My plan is to just toss stuff at it from up here. May the dice roll in my favor. I think that works. Oh, we can't do that from here. Mm -hmm. Don't know. I don't think that's going to reach her. Can you toss the potion? Do we have any more? We have one of those. See their chances. With ease. She's using up all the resources. Okay, Lazel. Yeah. 
maybe it can just, yes, distract it for a little bit. <laughs> Kill, okay, kill Lazel with the hammer. I'm gonna just. Oh right. Oh, I thought she would have a turn. Never mind. We're, I'm gonna. You know what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm gonna do. Sorry, Lazel. Sacrifices have to be made. Now we're just gonna toss stuff at it. Oh, it needs um. Fire. Allow me to demonstrate. It's, it's fine. I haven't seen it used that. I think honestly it was just a coincidence, the hammer, because it was going for something else. It's fine. It's fine. Because it can't reach his ear because it's dumb. <laughs> this is exactly why we're up here. In case this happened. Hmm? Wait, th what? Excuse me, you were in the lava, sir. That should... Why is he not superheated? I should totally be superheated right now. Things are... What do you mean things are looking grim? Th things are fine. Um, yeah, it's, it's not a problem. Yeah. I was like, why aren't you superheated or just silly thing? Toss some heavy in it. Right. Can I toss Gale? You think if I threw Gale, he'd count as bludgeoning damage? I think you would. That'd be a pretty epic way to end it. Toss Gale. Give Gale something to chuck. Death is but a word away. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> we've, we've got it. This is fine. <laughs> Not a problem. <laughs> yeah, I've never had it go quite that wrong so early before. Mm. But it's good to know that it's still fine. <laughs> Probably bring them back at Wivers, I think. It's gonna be easier. She, she, yeah, it happened a few times, didn't it? Mm, it did. Throwing everything. The only thing we didn't throw was Gale. I feel like you really, especially on auto mode, you really want someone up there in that safe zone. If you're gonna bring someone down. Or you can just have everybody up there too. That works. Just have them toss stuff. Um then we're gonna do the medium. That was heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, an extra nasty auto mode would be if someone dies. 
uh, then, like, that's it. They're gone forever. What happened here? Um, downstairs, the fight went south pretty fast. Upstairs, everybody was fine. <laughs> So, Astarian finished off the fight by just lobbing weapons that he'd picked up at the boss, and uh, that's how we won. Go. Just tossing stuff at it. Time for some fun. Overall, a smashing success. You know, sometimes sacrifices must be made. It's it's so funny though that every time I play. As a Starian, something like this happens at this particular fight. Like, he ends up sacrificing one or two, or everybody. The first time, he sacrificed everybody, um, and the killing blow, Shadowheart was under the hammer with the uh, boss. And he was the sole survivor. Alright, let's, let's, let's bring him back. Um, Withers, uh, we've had an incident. <laughs> really? Shadowheart, you'll be happy to hear Lazar's gone. Fate, dost thou require a new... I need to resurrect just, just everybody. With the... <laughs> this is the price of balance. <laughs> Well counted. After Act One, I yeah, it was always well. Keeping my distance. Starring to get into trouble. Will would somehow end up having to take the blame for it, and then he died. Like you know, when Starian stole from the temple, and then he gave Will the thing he stole from the temple, cursing both of them, causing not one, not two, but we had to fight three divas, two at once. Uh, one separate, another one separately. And, um, when we fought the duo Divas, yeah, Will got absolutely smashed. <laughs> and not in the way he wanted to get smashed either. <laughs> Wasn't alcohol, it was death. Mm. And then there was the bank. The bank incident. <clears throat> Might have aggroed the whole bank. Will might have died then too. That might have been also while Starin was trying to steal some things from the bank. <laughs> welcome, uh, welcome. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Completely understandable, given my greatest enemy in all video games. Uh, myself is gravity. <laughs> we have. Uh, we made him a Starian spawn in Dragon's Dogma, and uh, he likes to. He likes to leap leap off cliffs. Oh, I've got to get rid of the moles. Yeah, yeah, the dice. See, uh, yeah, my follow alert is also the dice sound. Sorry, was it making you paranoid? Were you thinking there was some, <laughs> there was some check around the corner? Hmm. Yesterday we did have that. Um, it turned out there was, there was like this dice roll constantly going off, and it turned out it was. Um, it was shovel. You stood next to some spicy mushrooms, doing saving throws. Yeah. So that happens. <laughs> Seriously? No. Um. Start. I think they've already got trauma from the spy. Oh, c c what the fudge? Yep, just go without Carlac. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it just, it just re basically was like, just no, she's not coming. That was really weird. Um, who's got that medium art? Oh, Carlac has. You like the mushrooms. Did I make too heavy by mistake? Might have. Oh no, there's a medium, okay. Gail. That's the Trito for Gail. I gotta get him the transmog mod. Right, um, right. 
Okay, first, let's get everybody out of here. Let's have it. Oh, I got some of the things let's back that I chucked at it. <laughs> Mr. Hines, like, what? We... We won. That's what matters. <laughs> Greatest challenge in BG is getting every party member on a single elevator. Oh my goodness, you have no idea. <laughs> Oh, he has the best, like, little, just chatty dialogues, yeah, when you're clicking on stuff. Right, for... Uh, that's not it. Gail. Gail gets some medium armor now. Um... Uh, so don't accidentally nuke it. Yeah, a bit more protection. Oh, oh, I know what I did. <laughs> I did it the wrong way around. It's fine, though. Because I, di I didn't accidentally delete the item, at least. I just, um, I just Can nuked the clothing. I gotta be careful about that on this run, though, because, uh, I could accidentally nuke something we don't want to. Appearance. Then effect. Oh, it's not that one. It's this one. Hey, how you doing, Gleb? Hope you're well. Hi, Eric. So far, the game is improving. Now we know why it won Game of the Year. It's so... It is such a good game. You know, I was a little, like, unsure at first, and now it's, like, my favorite game of all time ever. So, highly, 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 highly recommend. And then maybe we're gonna give it to Car. Honestly, Carlax being a bit squishy, so maybe we'll give it to Carlax. The heavy armor. We'll give Lazel this. And we'll give Carlax that. And then later, Car the later. Um, oh yeah, because later we're gonna make her a monk anyway, so she won't be able to use him. What is it? What's that letter? Oh, I could go for a good meal. Oh, I think I gave it to Gail. The worst is when you take the elevator back down. Oh, and then you and then everyone gets squished. Yeah, I had that happen at the Shar Temple, where someone got squished under the. They fell off the elevator and then got squished when I tried to come back down and get them. So you know that that can happen. Yeah, same bash, yeah, yeah, so it, 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 I, I wasn't sure at first, but I ended up really, really enjoying it. Like, it's not just my game of the year, I think it's my game of the decade, honestly. Okay. Right, we've got our fancy stuff now. She can, hang on, ooh, why are you... There. <laughs> Sorry, it was going back and forth and making me a bit dizzy then. Attention. Do do do. Keep your distance, darling. Oh goodness. Well, those two fights, you know, so far so good. I think everything went pretty well. Oh, we gotta do the uh what do you call um Mimics. We can do the mimics. Even if there's a flow below, strangely enough. Oh no! Just, yeah, that is not a fun way to uh, lose an auto mode, that. Mm. Doom Eternal's in your top three. Doom Eternal was a good game, good soundtrack too. Really fast paced as well. You kind of wish bodies gave Erico as like computers. You're trying to figure out why you feel bad. Aww. If it could like just, um, had some inbuilt system to tell you what was wrong. Do, do, do. Call that a game a chess in the open world. 
But yeah, no, it's... Uh, yeah, I definitely want to play more games like it. I really enjoy it now. It's nice because they don't make me motion sick, these games. It's something that's gotten worse as I've gotten older, that. So a lot of games in first person are a bit difficult for me to play now. Especially if they don't have settings that let you remove the motion blur. <laughs> Just the best franchise for you. Okay. okay, now the thing that's going to be annoying about these is they're going to try and steal our weapons. There's three of them. They're going to steal our weapons, probably. Ready and willing. Because they're mean. And if we're really unlucky, they'll take everybody's. Someone there. <laughs> you have my attention. Yum. Yeah, I couldn't, I could barely play Starfield. Yeah, the ship, the ship was, I mean, you know, you probably saw some of those streams, how bad it was. After a, a fight on those ships, I, yeah, I couldn't Charmed, I'm sure. barely function. Keep okay, first, let's have everybody... It cannot be added to inventory. Shall we? I'm gonna just kind of just use them as cannon fodder. As I was told. Oh, they keep <laughs> they keep coming back. I should look around. Either the hub is attacked. Whack it. He lost two characters to the one in the House of Healing. The damn thing only goes like ten feet. Oh no. Oh, she's in. <laughs> She's in dialogue. What would you say about Star Citizen? I've never played Star Citizen, I'm afraid, so I don't I don't really have an opinion on it. You want a pirate companion? There's, there's a pirate uh, clothing mod. If that helps, uh, Sunder. Pretty recent, like within the last month it was added. Star in and on. They won't see me coming. It's probably gonna be better to get rid of that one first. With the nest. Bye, see ya. Hey, 
finished rest. I hope you're well. I'm doing all right, thanks. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Victory is assured. We'll get him to halt that one at that, maybe. Nice. What's this? Okay, that yeah, yeah. So the, the one that was gonna go doesn't get to go anymore. So we'll have Karlak. Um... Oh shoot! I must I must have hit the hide button. Yep. That way we didn't have to worry about it pulling anyone back or stealing their weapon there. You hear this rustling sound all of a sudden, and you turn around and it's your cat trying to make off with a bag of popcorn! So they were trying to be sneaky, but ultimately failed. <laughs> oh, Sun, it's gonna be called Sundered's Angels. Totally not e egotistical. <laughs> Let's turn someone inside out. Be quick. Yes. <laughs> Okay, good, good, it's missing. Okay, we're out of command halt. Now, yeah, so. You gotta be careful. Well, we're out of spell slots. Oh, um, which one's going next? That one. A car like do it. Me or Saurian? <laughs> Welcome! Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good day today. Okay, we're getting lucky with that. <laughs> oh, not the ske Yeah, okay, just... Oh, she decided to hit the skeleton... ...underneath the chest instead of the chest itself. I knew that was gonna happen. At least one time. Kinda fine, though. Shovel's excited. So it can't steal her weapon. Yeah, you kind of want to avoid them because you can't pick it back up because it's in the chest. Well, unless it dies, of course. I'm gonna get a bit closer. got a bit of resistance against Starion's attacks, so he doesn't... This isn't his best fight. Alright, we'll just stop it so we can't take off our bet. Um, I've had it take... Quite a few weapons before. <laughs> I've had it take the offhand and the so, so basically the the swords and the, the the melee and the ranged. I've had it take both from a single character before. They they just got really unlucky. It might have been Karlak actually. <laughs> Funnily enough. But yeah, this is the third time it's happened to her today because the imps kept taking her um, stuff too. So she's she's not being good at avoiding that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, one of them's got some. Swiftly now. Some stuff in it. 
So ideally, we want to keep him up here. Punch it. <laughs> I love the idea of Carl like just punching it to death. Seems like something she'd do out of frustration. Let's go. Open up. Just punch the mimic. Ah, body can spare. Well, hello. Shall we? Tiny chest. Something over there. Okay, let's just get everybody out of here. Uh, I don't know if we have light right now, or if Gale can do it. He probably can't, he's not got spell slots. Um, so yeah, let's just get everybody out the way. <laughs> just in case Starring fails the disarm check. Oh, it was, it was like tiny. Barely a scratch. One step at a time. Okay, right. I think we've gotten everything from here now. So we can go to the colony. Starring sucking blood all the time, so I guess he's hydrated. Me? Well, we are cosplaying a vampire. <laughs> no worries, Stripe. See you later. Good night. Have a good one. Thanks Welcome for hanging back. out. Have you made any new discoveries? Oh, yeah. You've got to be real careful with that. Yeah, yeah. That trap on the way to the docks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got to be careful with that. Thankfully, there's a safe path. So once you know it, it's kind of easy to avoid. I tend to take everybody one at a time just to be safe. You know, just, just to be safe. Ah, what's it? Stay. Stay. Oh, it doesn't want to buy that. Okay. No, those are mine. Have you changed your mind about the ring? Oh, do they have some D and D link though? After all, I don't. I don't know much about those animes. I'm afraid. Mm. Uh, we might get that before we move on. Maybe later. you see you think of when you see um a mind flayer steve mm, calamari <laughs> oh goodness we'll be clear no point in lingering now i've got the noble stock trade okay oh strength potion um mm, stop stocking up on those resistance elixirs too She's not slowing a health potion. Oh, she is. I just couldn't see her. Vaulting. Everfall. Okay. Right. Oh, she can have these candles. Not sure why we had them. Gonna use that. Hmm. Okay. Oh, so we still gotta do the goblins versus the grove. We gotta go 
to the village on fire. I think that's it for Act 1. Oh, Ethel. Ethel. Anti Ethel. So we'll probably do goblins versus grow first. Hey, spirit. Welcome. Then... Ethel. And then make our way to the crash, I think. Oh, yeah, we should probably go back to him because we've got... Otherwise, I'm going to have this head in my inventory the whole playthrough. <laughs> Though we may... We may take the mushroom near head to play fetch with Scratch. Oh no! You had to... Oh dear. Well, we can't do this. She doesn't... In, in this honor running, you know, we, we can't do that. <laughs> we brought his head. It's a bit... ashy. <laughs> Drow sought to shatter our circle. Now his flesh may feed its growth. We ended up just being able to loot the head from death, the body because apparently it was just in such a state life, we couldn't cut it off. And thus we name you Life Chanter. Aww. Yeah, basically how long we salitate that head. Mm. As our circle grows, so shall your song. Wherever you go, only listen, and you may hear it. Nice. <laughs> oh, they're kind of cute. Right. Oh, yes. Yeah. Saza. A... Okay, we're gonna try and keep Minfara this time, so that means booping her, but not killing her. It's a shroom party. <laughs> Just gonna get some potions from Ethel. Then we'll uh, do a rest and then goblins, I think. I'm still waiting for someone with the spare Not me. eye. Stocking up. Oh, we gotta go to uh, Karlak, damn it. Let's do that before I forget. Up, We've got that iron for her. Oh, spider! Spider. <laughs> Gem. Um, I think the spider's gonna be fine because a starring can get rid of all the eggs and then the legendary effect becomes obsolete. So. Mushrooms and calamari. Oh no, chat's getting hungry. <laughs> Slightly concerned. Um, what was I... What was I doing here? Oh, we were gonna go to the grove and then I started talking about the spider so then I went here instead. Some Yorkshire pudding. Oh, do love a good Yorkshire pudding. Okay, we might do the spider first. Need anything else? Of course. But please. Uh, has he got remember. anything we need? Oh. No, not really. So Alright, we'll get Carlax sorted. Hey, how you doing? I hope you're well, Kappa. Again. Food. 
Doctor. My dagger. How fares the search? All right, we found the iron. Please let this work. Mm. The weight of it and that blaze of chaos. Can't imagine um, this. Um, I, I have so I've had this bug in the past Must where if I put the scrolls in containers, it doesn't always let me use them when I need them. And on on a mode, moment. if that happens, we could be, you know it could potentially ruin a run. So I'm just keeping them out of containers. <laughs> because it's a bit risky it was the same with potions too sometimes just potions weren't working when they were in there, there. and it was not consistent enough for it to be I'm something afraid. intentional so i feel I like it was a bug thick enough gloves in all the realms to protect from that kind of heat. but it would usually be at a really inconvenient time where that would happen yeah so i just keep them out of containers this feels because I don't want to deal with that, especially on an honor mode run. I'd rather Good. it just be a hot mess I'm still burning than hell's hole, but I feel it potentially less. bug out and we really need to scroll and we can't use it and Change then the run ends. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. Could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Find me again in Boulder's. <laughs> Star didn't like the idea of that. If I'm worth my salt, I'll have figured something out by then. Take care, Karnak. And hopefully the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. Pocket any infernal iron you find along the way. Hmm? Yes, but if you're if you get that bug and you need something and you can't use it, then you've wasted however many hours you played because you can't get the thing you need when you need it, and then you get a wipe. <laughs> Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Hmm. All right, let's go find some evil for you to smack. Bring it on. I keep forgetting we have coins for her. Looking for steel. You spend over five well, hours every platform organizing close. containers. I organize the containers at my stash because, you know, they're not, you know, we don't have to deal with a bug. Um, but, I, yeah, especially on honor mode, I don't want to risk it. Because it's happened to me too many times where I've just not been able to use something because it was in a container. I miss my forge. Welcome back. We'll get the, uh, susser thing. Um, oh, we might have to go buy a dagger. Oh, I should have bought a dagger while I was there. Uh, night, Lennon. Sleep well. Thanks for hanging out. Should be easy. No, we haven't we haven't done the goblin camp yet. We'll probably do that next. Ooh, are we uh, No, we'll do the spider. We'll level it cuz it's fine. We're level 5, hey, so. Hey, soldier. Uh, no, no, we started. Uh, this is the third stream for this run. isn't a risk for the biscuit definitely not no so i'd rather go as risk-free as possible 
Yes, we have the ogres. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, we should probably use them. Oh, we could use them at... They might be useful in the goblin camp, actually. Oh, no, they attack the owlbear. No. Well, maybe we could use them inside and then get rid of them before we go outside so they don't attack... Because we had that problem where they attack the owlbear. Um, so we get rid of them before that. And then we can use them inside. And they can tank that schmite, and we can get the headwear. Yeah, they went straight for the owlbear that one time, didn't they? They just went straight for it. Uh, no, the owlbear will only leave if um, the goblins are dead. But the problem is the ogres went outside with us, and then they just went to they just smashed everything, and they went straight for the owlbear for some reason. Weapon Looks like the Even though it wasn't have... initially hostile. Yes! Damon can use this to fix me. Um, oh, I haven't I haven't had that option pop up before. I don't think we've seen it at the camp yet on this run. <laughs> it should be there now though. It should be there now. It has to be a Oh, yeah, we might have to go buy a dagger. Oh, we got one. Never mind, we got one. I think I picked up the bark. Did we pick it up? We did. I'm no metalsmith. But I believe I need some fire. We have fire. <laughs> We've got it. Uh, but yeah, we don't really need their help outside. It just might be nice to have them tank the schmighty boss. That's all. Uh, welcome. Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. The roaring furnace awaits an offering. I like that they gave the susser weapons... Okay, it was a couple of patches ago now. They gave them all unique appearances. Before, they used to just look like normal daggers. But now they've got their own appearance. Hey, how's it going, Mark? Not too bad. We're just doing the automotive run right now. Going well so far. Okay. And then we're gonna... Yep. Swap it with that. But we're not going to go into the spider thing this way. We're going to go the other way. <laughs> yeah, I agree, right? It, it makes them feel a bit more special. Mm -hmm. Hi, Twigs. Not the little snack. <laughs> yeah, that's what a starring calls it the first time, isn't it? How am I back on Twitch? Um... So, they shut down monetization, but everybody here can still stream. I'm not on a VPN or anything. I'm streaming just from Korea normally, as I usually would. They haven't um, blocked anything yet. But there's no more partners or affiliates. Will that change in June when they offboard everybody? We don't know, because they're not telling us anything. So, we don't know if this is how it's going to be from now on, if it's temporary. We don't know. The coin disappears into the well. After a moment. But I never left. I I had been streaming since the shutdown and didn't stop. Just yeah, continued to stream. Um though likely they're not sending out notifications anymore. Yeah. It'd be nice to know for sure what's going on, but it is what it is. And because of all the confusion, every, every once in a while I've had someone scream at me for still streaming, like I'm doing something naughty when we're not. Um, because, like I said, they haven't blocked the country from streaming. They shut down monetization. So most of the streamers, of course, they move to platforms where they can monetize. Um, you know, unfortunately, we're in this position where those Korean platforms weren't really a choice for us, so we didn't get any help uh, moving to YouTube at all. Just like old times. 
so we still stream on Twitch, but we stream on YouTube as well now. I do live in Korea, yep. Unfortunately. <laughs> Okay, I think we're going to bring in a shovel for the surprise because it's going to be easier. Uh, it's about 10 a.m. Oh, but they've got detect though. Oh, this one hasn't. See invisibility. Oh, he's, he's done well though. <laughs> Shovel's like, I'm going to get you. Good job, Shovel. Huh? Oh, excuse me. Yes. <laughs> I mean, Twitch is still functional there, at least, you know? I'm a full-time streamer for six years, so... Losing Twitch hasn't been great. Unfortunately. And we still haven't. A lot of us here are still missing our final payout. Which is kind of added to the stress a little bit. Oh, yeah, his spell slots are dire right now. Oh, <laughs> Caroline got caught further down. I feel like Twitch should have shown. I don't. I don't really know what happened. Yeah, like the shutdown itself was more on the government and the ISPs here, but how it was handled was entirely on Twitch. Um, and unfortunately, it wasn't handled very well. It was handled in a way that unfortunately caused a lot more stress and upset for partners and affiliates here. And a lot of it was down to just lack of information, lack of um, communication, you know? Like, it took weeks and many emails for me to get a message um, admitting that something had gone wrong with the payments, uh, for the final payments. Because I was getting very dismissive and rude emails for a while, trying to figure out what was going on when they were telling me to contact my bank, but my bank was saying they didn't have any record of it and I had to contact Twitch. And then a couple of days ago they said, oh yeah, there's some, there's some issue. And to wait a little longer, but it's, you know, it's been over a month. Um, you know, things are going on YouTube, but it's kind of like building up from scratch again. Um, what do I like to stream on more? Twitch has more features. YouTube you can get a higher quality with, though, so that's kind of nice, but, you know, Twitch was my home for six years. I forgot he's got little legs. He can't get up there. <laughs> you don't like watching streams on YouTube. The interface is too alien for you. It's not too bad. It's been disappointing to say the least, I hope. Yeah. Time to strike. Uh, 
Oh, where is that other one? Oh, it's around there. <laughs> kind of far away. I don't think I can reach it. No. Fuck yes. Close ranks. Maybe Karlak can shoot it. Uh, Tari, thank you so much for becoming a, 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 Mon a Munchkin member uh, over on YouTube there. I do appreciate it. Thank you so much. <laughs> you get some Munchkin hype in the chat um, for Atari there. Thank you so much. I do appreciate it. Enjoy your emote, your badge, and all those uh, membership goodies. Oh, thank you, Spirit. Yeah, I mean, that's all we can hope for, really, that things will work out in the end. to go the long way around. Oh, now he's going back. <laughs> Give over. Indeed. Oh, poor Gale. Move, maybe. He's poisoned. Victory awaits. <laughs> I wanted to jump so she could avoid the web, but she decided to go into the web anyway. Almost gone. It's go time. Go on, Karlak. Easy. Just one final whack. We're good to go. Okay. Now we just have to worry about getting rid of the baby eggs. Yes, please. We should be fine. Probably do a long rest though first. Do you want to get off the web, Lazel? So you don't accidentally bring the Spider Queen over here. I don't know if she can come over here, but knowing our look, she will. <laughs> so we don't want to tempt fate. How do people do this all day? That's his backstory. Oh goodness. Uh, Gail's gonna get sacred. Fl is gonna sacred flame. He will if we don't do a long rest. I do really enjoy your streams, uh, and you're always fabulous. Oh, thank you, Ariel. I'm glad you enjoy the streams. Yeah, it's been it's been a bit been a bit weird the past couple of months because I feel like, despite us being able to stream on Twitch, there's still been this like noticeable shrink, you know. So again, it could be partly maybe because I don't think Twitch are really sending out notifications for the channel like they used to. I mean, why would they? So that could be part of it, and people are looking, seeing no VODs, maybe thinking I'm not streaming here anymore when we are. So it's all just a, it's all a bit of a mess. Okay, we're gonna give the shoes to Lazel, maybe. can find them. <laughs> hey, Ellie! What, uh, what did I drink? Oh, okay. It's just a fire resistance potion. <laughs> Which way to the nearest library? Oh, I get... What, where, oh, they went to Gale. <laughs> Into the space madness. Someone there. Uh, Wood Elf as well, welcome! Thank you so much for becoming a member over on YouTube. Let's keep that Munchkin hype going there. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate that. Enjoy your emotes and your badge, and welcome to the family. Ah, uh, you never watch TV. 
I feel like, yeah, a lot of these days people watch streaming services more, don't they? And then TV. You slept around the clock. Oh my god, it sounds like you needed the sleep though. Hopefully you're feeling refreshed. Oh my goodness, Ellie, thank you so much for gifting five memberships as well over there. Um, two. Uh, Shaky Wild, Ian, Gian, and Dominus, welcome to the family. Please enjoy uh, your lovely emotes and uh, your badges too. Thank you so, so much. I do appreciate it. Uh, for anyone wanting to enter the giveaway, you can do so uh, via the YouTube here. I'm not entirely sure how we can do a giveaway where it includes both chat chat because Nightbot is separate and Moobot's separate, so <laughs> we're just doing all the YouTube today. Mm -hmm. Use Amazon uh, Prime at Prime and Netflix. Mm -hmm. Um, we were two hundred and eighty-eight. That's five, six, seven. I think today added on to that. The, the, yeah, the, the last number it told me was uh, two hundred and eighty-eight. So blessings upon to add seven. And that's where we are, I think. Always watching. <laughs> um, she's kind of fine. Join you, but oh no 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 no! You're staying here, darling. Um, I was just uh, curious if she had more to say. Uh, I want to catch up with Lazel so she doesn't get you know we don't end up losing her at the crash. Time for a chat. So Speak. we want to be careful. <laughs> mm. We'll tell her about the, the disc. disc in your mind's eye. Oh, she likes being shown the disc, but she doesn't like the disc the itself. Tissu markings, ancient. I recognize them, but I can't. The only thing sense. I'm going to watch on the telly is no. Doctor Who. Wait. Um, I think we can. I can actually watch that the when it comes out over I here now with Disney Plus. It's a story. You used to have to wait so about... long. About to Orpheus. watch it over here. Your head buzzes in concert with Lazelle's, but it hardly matters. Even without the connection, you'd recognize her discomfort. Hmm. I read this one already. What do you make of it? Trivial, all of it. Gith declared Vlakith <laughs> queen of the Empire, and her oh, Lazelle, you're in for Orpheus a shock a later. To the Goodness. Gith. Mm, and if it's true, sounds like Vlack has betrayed Gif and seized the throne. She did nothing of the sort. Thank your good fortunes, I'm a tolerant woman. <laughs> or I'd have sliced off a few toes for suggesting it. I feel like she'd be a bit more harsher if a Gif Yankee said that. Mm. Oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> Every every playthrough. Hmm. Do you think that dream figure it will come back? Certainty. Oh, by the I way, Astarian's dream lover is Astarian. He is he he is his own dream visitor. <laughs> You'll probably see at least one more time, I think. Um. The absolute is this master. I'm sure Perhaps. of it. Absolute may be a mere pseudonym behind which this master hides. Whatever this voice, whomever this master, it dominates dreams. Uh, no, no, it's minds. just a separate mod that puts his head into the car the CC. Got a Carlac one in there somewhere. So you can like make your Tav him or like Carl have have their head and then edit them, but yeah, it's just, it's just literally just adds the head in. Um, yeah, I think I think she's kind of fine. I think she likes us. Someone's guardians Gortash. Gortash has a lot of fans. There's like there's a whole group and they they love Gortash. There's fan art and everything. The only dream lover Steve needs is Steve, exactly. So far, so good. We did have that situation again at the Forge where, you know, kind of the starring sacrificed everybody again. 
Um, we had Gail and a star in at the top this time, and uh, but Lazel and Carlac died. We had there were some issues, um, so they're both just dead, dead, and. Astarian and Gale are just chucking weapons we found at the boss and causing bludgeoning damage. And it, and it worked. It died. <laughs> it was, it was, you know, effective. It couldn't attack them. Full Gortash robes and all. I kind of, I kind of love it. <laughs> Young, handsome Gortash. He's got a chin for days. Right. Um, okay. I'm just going to go grab a drink. And then we're going to do kitty cat treats. And then we're going to do the spider. Okay. So I will be right back. Uh, yeah, there's an orange head as well. Yeah, I've got that one too. Yeah. Can even get... Um, she looks very different when she's not... Like, with any of her skin. <laughs> yeah. She looks really different. Okay, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Okay, we're back. Right, should we do kitty cat treats? We've got one. Oh, We've got one left, and then some biscuits, I think. Yeah. <laughs> one tuna stick and then biscuits. Oh, Jenny's like, it's mine! Come on. 
He's not feeling like jumping on the desk today, it seems. Mmm, he is, yeah. Sometimes he just, yeah. Okay. Come on, biscuit. You got it. Difficult for, you know. Come on. Ah, that was my finger. You care. <laughs> you care. Oh, he went for food bowl. Ready? You care. Do you want one more? That was definitely my finger that time. Oh, he almost broke skin. All right, one more, one more. Hang on. I've got to just wash my hand because she slabbered it all over me. <laughs> um, um, um. Yeah, usually it's Killy that does that. But, um... Yeah, Nuka, Nuka wasn't feeling jumping up on the desk this morning. The big eyes get you every time. She's cute until the food comes out, then she turns into a goblin. Jenny, what are you doing? Thanks for the follow. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good one. Right, spider boss. First, we're going to be play it safe and just send a star in at first. Do I have enough fire arrows? Yeah, oh, it's 17. We got plenty. Leave everybody else here. Correct me. Might be all the set. Okay, shovel. Trust no one. Just make sure they have their potion. Gail, what are you doing up there? Oh my goodness, Gail! You had one job, and it was to keep everybody away, just out of trouble. And instead, you decided to go in there. Right. <laughs> Um, poison res. No, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> well, okay, hello. just him and Gale want the poison res. Okay, good. No. Right, first we're gonna we're gonna deal with the eggs. And if we're lucky, it'll be fine. This went fine on my test run, but you know, you know how it is when we're live. Very, very Usually quiet. things don't go according to plan. Stepping softly. Uh, maybe you've got to wait until that spider is a little further away. I'm gonna play it safe. You go distracted to take a star in alone, sneaking. Yeah, wait for it to walk on the webs. Ah, fireball, then turn based. Yeah, you, I mean, because you can also boop her down that hole, can't you? Still one egg there. Try 
for some reason I'm having trouble reaching, but I know I can reach them because I've done it before. Hmm, like that. Okay, we're just going to wait for the spider to move. Resets. Okay, like set number one gone. <laughs> oh, they made it. We can't push her down the hole anymore. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw a lot of people do that. Oh well, she's not much of a problem without the eggs, thankfully. So. Okay, I was like, we definitely have more invisibility potions. Something smells tasty. Put it there so I can get it quickly. <sighs> okay, you can push the little ones, but not the matriarch anymore. That's fine. Never did that myself anyway, so it works. It works out. I'm gonna get this set first, then this set, and then visible. Make it hurt. On the hunt. She's suspicious, but she doesn't seem to care too much. Got him, Sorry, right? No there. eggs. <laughs> oh, she's already hurt herself. Okay. Yeah, I think I think we got rid of all of them. I don't see any left. Surprise, okay, good, good. Right, now we can sort of bring everybody. It's fine, safe. This really is a my forte. We'll sneak it out. Do you remember the days, Whisper, when we used to be able to push Kazador off the ledge and he forgot that he could fly? <laughs> and he'd just die instantly. Those one round Kazadors really were funny. Yeah, the shovel. Shovel's the, the big guns. <laughs> it's true. Oh my goodness. Critical miss. Okay, our spider's not there. Oh, you can still push R enough, though. <laughs> um, I usually push her minions off. Push and use the, uh, no, well, you know, I'll, I use the explosive arrows to push them off so we don't have to deal with them in their sanctuary. Mm, the good old days, right? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, you have to be in a very specific spot, though. You miss out on a gear, though, now if you uh, shove R in. Unless it just boops it back up. Oh, maybe it'll boop it back up because of the stones. That's the only thing I can imagine it may be doing that. Go 
shovel go. Oh, shovel got seen. The dance macabre. It's my fury. Don't want to push it over there because if it somehow does fall, uh, we wouldn't get loot and we want loot. Uh, yeah, because we want the dagger, don't we, really, from Auron? Pretty six percent. Yeah, it was gonna be small. The last board is set. With Can we peace. command halt? I think we could if we were closer. <laughs> Maybe. in the next round. Oh, Gail, can you reach anything? We'll do a blast. Don't want everyone bundled up though. Oh, oh, Carlette might be able to. Yes, okay. Command halt is today's spell of it's the spell of the day. Why do you want to go down there to shoot her? That doesn't make sense. The logic for that move was not was not there. <laughs> Ideally, I might do command come here. Ideally, we kind of want her. We want to hear, but not mobile. Yeah. Right, Glenn? Yeah, they're really good, um, weapons. Um... My pleasure. Oh, all right. Eh, tried. He tried! <laughs> Can't reach. Unleash me. Oh! Ah! Sometimes when I'm... Today when I'm moving the camera... Uh, twice now, I have accidentally hit the spacebar and uh, skipped the turret. <laughs> well, I'm just trying to move the camera. But why would you want to do that and skip the dialogue? When the talks with Varen are so interesting. Oh, you didn't- wait, you didn't get the stone. Doesn't that- I imagine that might be problematic for the game. <laughs> Not having the stone. Uh, hey, how you doing? I hope you're having a good one today. Welcome. Good morning. I'll have them try and deal with the spider. Oh no. Well, let's get rid of it. So we only have to deal with the queen. <clears throat> 
She's gonna come over here this next turn. Oh, sadly though, Lazel. Her turns out bef <laughs> just before it. Oh, it didn't come. Mm. Maybe because they'd have to jump. It's the only thing I can think of that stopped it. Over here, so maybe we'll just let it phase over. That might be best. <laughs> you skip a lot of dialogue. Um, so this is one of the few games where I, I haven't been. But yeah, I'm. We're just. I've already, you know, as mentioned in the previous stream, we've we've got the, um, I've, I've made a plan for every fight, so. We're going to stick to my plan. I'm not doing a speed run, though. This is, this is, we're doing an honor run, but we're not doing a speed run. Of course you'd skip if you're doing a speed run, but we're not, we're not, we're not doing that. <gasps> you can't, st don't say that in front of Sunder. Sunder really loves Aaron. Aaron's their favorite. Okay, we'll just heal her up, ready. Okay, please come over here. There's none left. They're all dead. Okay, fine. <laughs> I just I think it's just gonna be easier to bring it over here. Now we can command because when I did command approach, she she didn't move. She just stayed there. And I'm assuming it's because Um It's probably got something to do with her having to jump her face to get over here. She kept stealing Lazelle, so she had it coming. Yeah, she steals Lazelle a lot on mine too. Lazel and Gale. I've not had her steal Halson before, but I know she can. <laughs> Orin's a delight. Oh, you don't like speedruns? They're very short. Yeah, you know a character exactly. A character's well done if you either love or hate them. If they move you emotionally, whether it's positively or negatively, you know they're well written. Like, we hate Wolbram because he's so well written. <laughs> and because Barkus is just so lovely, you know? This is gonna feel good. In comparison, and we want we want Barkus to be happy. And he deserves a better friend. Oh did you did you manage to find something, Aya? It's only one health left. Get a whack. Or not. You know, or not, Gale. You can you can do that. <laughs> Shovel finished it off. Where Gale failed. I wonder. Oh. Lazel wants to talk. I have a Oh no! Lazel, this is not the time. Oh my god. You're not on the list. <laughs> Unimpressively bland. <laughs> right, really? We're gonna do this in front of everybody right now. In, in a spider cabin. <sighs> All right. <laughs> yeah, like Joffrey from Game of Thrones. Yeah. Just fantastic actor. <laughs> he just did such a good job. 
<laughs> but it's Lisa. Um, <laughs> I like she's on the list potentially for Shadow Hearts, but she wasn't on the list for this one. Uh, I do feel guilty skipping all the great dialogue, even if I've heard it about ten times over. I guess it's safe. We already Gail already weaved us, so I mean it would be it'd be fine, I guess. Um. <laughs> Uh, can I assume a compliment's coming? I don't pay compliments. I only say what is true. Apparently, um, defeating spiders time. in spider caverns really does it for Lazel. Courageous. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon for plunging into another. <laughs> I'd You've like to see that. Respect, and more still, my yearning. When I come near... Your odor alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hair stand on end. Is that Rosemary in Vermont? <laughs> you found fabric you like, but uh, not what you kind of wanted, right? You're going for a green or purple medium weight fabric. I guess that's half of the struggle, right? Finding the right fabric you want, but also the right fabric that's a reasonable price. Because I heard, like, certain types of fabric are just ridiculously expensive for even the smallest amount. She has bad timing. She knows what she wants, at least, you know? And we respect that. That's that's so mean. Hmm. Alright, what do we want to do with Lazel? Chat. I'm going to let chat decide, because I, th I think we're safe with Gail, so. What do you want to do? She, 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 she just tells you straight. <laughs> She comes on really strongly, is that? Yeah, that's true. It, the first time it happened, it was really early game. For, she was the first person, I think, in my first playthrough. And I was like, whoa. One moment she's like, I, you know, you're, you're a nuisance. I hate you. And then the next moment she's like, I want to lick your skin. And I was like, excuse me? <laughs> confusion. Okay, we're going to go confusion first. Hold on. Who coming on to me? Isn't it obvious? I want to taste you. More confusing. Perhaps tonight, perhaps later, but I want it all the same. Oh, she, she's... Do you? Very instant. <laughs> is is he going to get down with Lazel this playthrough? I'll let chat pick. One, two, or three. I like that she- I, I do like the directness though, you know? It's like, there's no confusion. It's like, this is it. Got one- two votes for two. She wants that vampire experience, oh goodness. One vote for free. Two votes for free. I'm not sure if Gail- she would eat Gail alive. Gail wouldn't stand a chance. One. Free free. Oh, it's mixed. One, two, three, four. Four for free. One, two, three, four for two. Two for one. Across the chats. Three for one. Banger. <laughs> I think more people are saying one or two. Collectively. <laughs> oh. Uh, okay, sure thing. We've been wanting a hot Giffy Yankee girlfriend. girlfriend but I, <laughs> I hope this doesn't way. mess it up with Gail. Yes or no? Might be fine. There's always Halson. Um, oh, all right. Yes. It's just I could just Perhaps awkwardly saying it in front soon, of everybody. I will come to your bunk and take what is mine. Poor Gail. Until that night comes. He's right there. I shall keep enjoying. I have a star scent. and a lazel under my belt, but you really want Magic Man to riz you up. Oh. I like that lazel is amazing, but having to break up with her if we choose someone like Gail is scary. <laughs> oh, is she gonna have choice words? Well, I mean, this isn't a commitment. This is just, you know, it's just um. Um. You know, they're, they're not, there's no commitment right now. <laughs> it's more of a wham bam thank you ma'am at the moment. It doesn't mess with Gail. Because I've, so the reason why is because we've had one playthrough where all the romance is bugged. Because <clears throat> we tried to romance everybody because it just seemed like what Starion would do at the beginning. Um, and uh, it broke everything. <laughs> it broke. 
every romance. <laughs> the game was just like, what are you doing? <laughs> It's about, yeah, yeah, exactly, Bob. Exactly, Bob. That's what it is. Who said that? Did someone say they wanted to go down there? Oh, a starian. I can't push a starian off. Lost in thought. I'm tempted. <laughs> Steve Robins is everyone. It's it just, it, cause yeah, we were going on like, that was the first honor run. Uh, not the, the, sorry, the first origin run. And we were doing like, what would a starian do? And you know, act one, it's all about, we're, we're getting people on our side, the alliances, um, you know, making our way around camp, trying to see who we can manipulate. But uh, apparently we went, we, we, we were too strong. <laughs> the game was like, no. She gets in- just wait, she gets inspiration if you push her off. <laughs> Wouldn't you need Featherfall though for that? I feel like she probably wouldn't get the inspiration if she's dead. And I can't do that to Garlic. You draw soft with Polly, but your male barbarian just wants Karlak and Orin. Is the, is are you sure the Orin part isn't you? <laughs> Karlak would get along with another barbarian though, that's true. They'd get along really well. You wouldn't say no to Lazel while standing on the edge of a cliff, no matter what. <laughs> um, Lazel would be a scary one to push. But thank you for the free inspiration there. Yeah, yeah, basically, Desi, yeah. So I found the same. If we don't, if we go more for more than two, that's when it tends to break. And you tend to, uh, or, or it'll lock you out of the others, I noticed, yeah. I feel like when the game first came out, it wasn't like that. So at the, some point, patches and whatnot change things a little bit. But also, when the game first came out, there was that problem where everyone was a little too eager. E more eager than they were supposed to be. And that's why Gale was just jumping on everybody. Yeah, you opened up your other playthrough, Bob's Gate. Completely went blank. Does it matter if I go through the mountain past the Grim Forge? Um, so, if you go through the uh, mountain pass, you get to do the Gif Yankee Crash first. You know, where the Blood of Lythander is. You can go back to there, but you have to go back before I think you go to the Sharon Temple, because if you get there, I think it's the point of no return where the Emperor says he can't protect you anymore if you go back. Um, so what I prefer to do is I go to the Gifyanki crash first, and then I go to the um, Act 2. You miss Horny Jail Gale. He really did need a jail, didn't he? It, he was... he was bad. <laughs> But some people think like that's just Gale now, you know? They thought that was just him. It ruined his reputation. Yeah, because I, I was thinking she can't get inspiration if she's dead. Can she? Do we need any more? Well, something close. Arrows or. We kind of got Oh, we found another piece. Oh, he can't until Act 2. Worked out a schematic for a new design. Might take so far, so we did about three bosses today, suitable. didn't we? If it can even be done. But it's you had to fight off Gale with a believe. stick. Yeah, even if you were Anything romancing other characters, Gale no. didn't care. Everything. He was hiding in the bushes, waiting. <laughs> oh, oh, she's in the forest with a Starian. Yeah, I think this is my time. This is my time. <laughs> Probably in there with Wivers, who knows everybody's business. He knows who has bosom companions and who doesn't. Yeah, we had that. We had that uh, head cannon, didn't we? <laughs> it 
him and then eventually Halston went in the bush with him as well to watch because he also seemed to know everyone's business. You never get that cutscene with Carl like at the camp. Yeah, same. I'm, I'm wondering if it's bugged. A few people, funnily enough, a few people recently were discussing on Twitter if it was bugged. Uh, her romance line right now because I think wasn't wasn't like Tom on Neil's stream also having issues with like Carlax romance scenes triggering too and like instead it was just Gail all the time. Um, but yeah, a few people have been talking on Twitter about it like her scenes just not popping up so could be which would be a shame because she's in the running for same same so it's maybe something either something changed or there's a bug he still hasn't if they finished act two yet because Mo I think for most of the characters, if you go to Act 3 without they're getting the scene, they basically just break up with you in Act 3. <laughs> oh my goodness. It sounds like that they might... It, it, it does sound like... It's, it's so many people have mentioned that they're having issues with it that it feels like a bug. Oh, he's going to be devastated if in Act 3 um, they don't get it and then she breaks up with him. Oh, that'll be the worst. I do we enjoy our need... What do you Hi, Gail. I need something from him. So I haven't really spoken to him yet. Um, I don't want to kiss his feet, though, because that's gross. Because he can, like, steal the ring, but it's gross. Maybe Gail should do it, but it's sleight of hand. Probably just easier to kill him. <laughs> you never even got the Shadow Heart scene. Ninja said you gotta get a lot done with her early or you're locked out. Oh yeah, Shadow Heart's like that. Yeah, yeah. And um, if you get with the other characters, she's not too happy about that either, is she? Mm. So there is that. You can't fight Shadow all hard off with a stick. <laughs> yeah, I'll be I'll be disappointed if there's some bug with Carlac and she's not in the running on Shadow Hearts, because Shadow Heart wants that. Tom and Neil's stream has had the hardest time getting Carlac. It all started when Tom's character Astra is blocked by Neil's character Bowie getting Will Dan's cutscene. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes the order which they trigger is really weird too. So, um, I had this issue before where I had a wizard character and she was supposed to be for Gale, but Astarian scenes kept triggering first. And Gale just wasn't doing anything. And he wouldn't do anything until Astarian scenes had happened. It's like there was an order to it for some reason. <laughs> So, long story short, Gail missed out. <laughs> uh, I think I bought everything I need from them. I'm just making sure we got everything we need from them as well. I gotta check that one inside too. Before we, you know, cause chaos. Oh, that's just, what? the owlbear is not here. Maybe it'll be here when we, I don't know. We did go to the cave. He's really struggling. Rivers stays there together, but none of Carlux's romance scenes are triggering. Oh, it really sounds like she's bugged, doesn't it? Ah. Ah. She does agree to the drought twins, though. Um, Minfara threatened you. Carlac didn't tell us. Uh, yeah, we didn't have the nighttime scene where. I don't think Carlac's in the running on this. It's been a while since I've had Carlac. Um, you know, her first scene where she just bluntly tells you what she wants. I, I haven't had that in a while. I used to get it most playthroughs and... Um, which again is another thing making me wonder if they changed something. 
significantly to a point where it's like she get you can get locked out really early or if it's just bugged. Let's take a fireball. <laughs> then, Pleasure. very important, she stays alive because she has a nice crossbow for us later. You love the camp event notifications mod, so you know exactly when the scene... Oh, that's that's actually a really useful mod, that. It'll probably make it easier to determine if something is bugged or not, too, I guess, right? So we'll probably do... Help Alison, Minfara, and then that guy. Mm, mm, mm. Probably do it that way. But I, th I think today has been pretty much a success. Free bosses. You've been cooking rats in Haven't here? really had any close calls. <laughs> Rimforge didn't quite go according to plan, but we, you know, it wasn't. We weren't in trouble. Because we'd positioned um, Sarin and Gale at the top, so overall it went fine. Was looking at me all strange. I think this will be a good place for us to end it today. So next week we'll be clearing the goblin camp and anti Ethel probably. Yeah, yeah, I usually do. Yeah, I usually do the goblin camp towards the end. Uh, welcome, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Be happy they didn't throw you to the spider. Uh, chat, uh, what if, hear me out, you did a dirge run with Orin as your crazy ex-girlfriend. The sort of run where dirge would be drinking themselves into oblivion over Orin. I mean, Orin's already pretty obsessed with Dark Urge when you think about it, you know? The dwarf is ready yet? Just, um, to the point where Ooh, it, it consumed her because no she... Bones. No has this need Duh, to be boring. bald chosen. Orin ha poor Orin, she's she's got a lot on her plate, you know. Yeah, same Glenn. So I yeah, that it, same, same. Because I feel like having the party at the end. Yeah. So I, I think that's why I've been doing it that way too. My first playthrough it just naturally occurred like this. Um but it is, yeah, my preferred way of going around it is um, under dark first, party last, to all, towards the end, you know. <laughs> Thank you, I hope. Thank you, kids, Matt. Um, so we're going to do the giveaway roll for YouTube. Um, if, you, if you win, please make sure you... If it calls your name, please make sure you speak up in YouTube chat, okay? Um... Because we'll be re-rolling if the person isn't here. The rules were uh, just as long as you're, you're a subscriber plus you're present, um, then you can win. I'll it's you. because we have to contact you and um, unlike Twitch, we can't DM right. people. So we need to know who you are so we can contact you. you All right, we're going to do the roll for Sorry, the Baldur's Gate copy on PC. Are you ready, eyes. YouTube? <laughs> well, let's see. There was a lot of entries. 41. 41 entries today. Are we ready? Okay. Is uh, Mohammed in chat? Mohammed, are you there? It's not over until we get a confirmation. Is Mohammed in chat? Oh, the maybe not. <laughs> there might be another chance. Orders were to stand by here. No booze, no sneaking off. Duh, you're all boring. I don't think they're in chat. <laughs> all right, we're gonna have to. I think we're gonna have to re-roll. I don't think they're there. Final call for Mohammed. Are you in chat? You've been cooking rats in here. Smells good. <laughs> nah, that ain't right. All right, we gotta, we gotta, re, we gotta re-roll it. Okay. Steve, it's Steve. Steve. See, Steve's there. Okay. <laughs> right, you're here, Steve, aren't you? Way. 
<laughs> All right, Steve it is. Thank you, Steve, for watching the stream and being here at the end for the roll there to you. You are the winner of Copy of Baldur's Gate. I will get your uh, code to you. Uh, are you in the Discord? Uh, by any chance, Steve? That might be the easiest place to pass it along to you if you are. Alright, is it the same name there? Okay. Alright, so I will send you your code. Uh, after stream. Congratulations to Steve, the winner of the copy of Baldur's Gate today. Uh, I do hope you enjoy that song, uh, PC. Hopefully you'll enjoy this game as much as, uh, as I have. <laughs> and you'll have lots of so You'll make you brilliant characters and have lots lies. of wonderful memories. Um, thank you so much, everyone, for hanging out today and for all the love. Um, Astarian returns on Saturday, so Saturday, Sunday, we do our honor run. Uh, Wednesday is Dragon's Dogma with Shadowheart. Uh, we do like a, a sort of Dragon's Dogma-esque uh, Shadowheart cosplay for that because our character Shadowheart and our, our pawn is Astarian. And then on Friday, we'll have community games. It'll probably be some Fallout or Helldivers. Uh, and we'll be starting the Shadowheart cosplay soonish, probably oh, towards no. the end of the month. I think she'll be oh, ready to go. Um, not sure what day that's going to be on yet. Uh, the Shadowheart run. We'll see. <laughs> when when it's ready to go, I'll, I'll plan the day. Um, but we'll probably be having the honor run and that going on at the same time, I think. Just got the final bits of the cosplay to sort out. <laughs> uh, welcome, thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it. Uh, so stream's always at 5 p.m. ET. Uh, if you haven't, uh, please make sure, and you're over on the Twitch side, you follow us on YouTube. You can get lots of extra content there. That's also our main platform now uh, that Twitch career shut down. Uh, but we still stream on Twitch. It's just we can't, um, you know, we can't monetize. We're, there's no partnership or affiliate here anymore, sadly. Um, so YouTube and Kofi are where you can go if you've been enjoying the stream and you'd like to uh, support on Kofi. We also have memberships too, uh, where you can get access to a lot of cosplay photos, cat photos, lots of extra behind the scenes stuff, things like that, early access to content as well that's coming up. Um, you can also get some early access with our YouTube memberships too, if you're a quantum munchkin or a buff. Um, if you want to get videos that I'm bringing out early, because now we're making long form content, short form content, and the live streams. And a lot going on since the uh, move to so YouTube. You be, <laughs> yes, Wednesday will be our next stream, Dragon's Dogma. Um, the Starian Pawn's been very um, popular and um, every day he keeps getting armor gifts. <laughs> someone's been playing dress up with him. <laughs> the best one was when someone gave him pants because he had these like... It was better than what he had, so I put it, in, I put him in it. But they, it was basically Smell like stockings kids. and tiny pants. So his like yeah, his butt cheeks were hanging out. Right. Um, someone hired him and then gave him pants, <laughs> which I thought was really fun. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, he just he he's uh, he's been getting a lot of presents, um, and you can actually hire him. You can hire our Starian Pawn in your Dragon's Dogma game if you wish. Uh, if you check out my latest YouTube video, uh, it's got his pawn ID on there. If you uh, want to bring him into your game, he's um, an archer. He's pretty good. Who I don't know who it was. <laughs> No one in the Discord said it was them. I think it was someone random. <laughs> Again. Maybe Did someone who watched the YouTube video? I'm not thing. sure. Uh, but yeah, I still to this day don't know who gave him the pants. Uh, but thank you, whoever you were. <laughs> because he was a little bit underdressed for adventuring, honestly. Right, um, so let's see where we're gonna we just head off forest. today. Drow wants to know exactly where those adventurers came from. <laughs> what are they doing? Hiding in trees? Are any of my Feel teammates on today? No Let's have problem. a 
Oh, oh more of them. Let's go over the to Mars. I was looking at me all strange. Right. Kind of rare that I can um, raid Mark. Right we did start a little early today. Certainly you won't be because he's a beautiful. Oh, wait, is she? Oh, no, she's what going. Need to be looking at any <gasps> I think she's heading off to bed. We're all on the same side. Although we're going to set the truth. Not sure if someone's saying goodnight to her or if she's finishing. Okay, I think she's finishing. <laughs> Ignore All right, uh, we'll pick throw you to the someone yet. else. Let's have a There's a lot of people on right now. Do you think the dwarf is ready um... yet? I'm hungry. Oh, okay. Oh, Charles on. I don't know if we've had a chance to raid before. They're playing some... Redfall. Uh, oh, with Jessica as well. Uh, also, friend from Fallout. All right, so we'll go ahead over there to Charo. Uh, do you give us Munchkin Love and Munchkin Hype? So you're awesome, a good friend from the Again, Fallout community. You wanna become spider food? <laughs> and I will see everybody on Wednesday. Have a lovely rest of your weekend. Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, Steve will be getting that code to you shortly. Um, yeah. <laughs> Look forward to YouTube shorts coming out uh, tomorrow and the day oh, after. The They'll be up at around 11 p.m. ET. I'll see you later, everybody. Exactly where those adventures <laughs> bye bye. Came from. What are they doing? Hiding in trees? We'll smoke them out, no problem. I tell you, the scrying eye was looking at me all strange. Right. What would some drow wizard in Moonrise want to look at you for? Certainly you won't be because he a beautiful eyes. What do they need to be looking at any of us for is what I'm saying. We're all on the same side. Although we're going to set the true soul on fire. They're drow. They're stuck-ups. Ignore them. And be happy they didn't throw you to the spiders yet.